Hello and welcome to my missing head bug workaround. From time to time it happens that but equipment like undersuit or armor as you see in this but there is a much easier and faster main menu and uh, go to purpose and universe and go to character customization. The only thing I have to do is to change the gender. Accept, save. Accept, save. The only thing I have to do is to change the gender. Accept, save. The only thing I have to do is to change the gender. And go to character customization. Only thing I have to do is to change the gender. Accept, save. This is location. Now uh, we will see if the head is back. Usually the head is back. In most cases, yes, looks looks good for us. But from time to time, it uh, still not. Uh, are they possible to equip any undersuit, like in this case? And let me put my helm on. And as you can see, uh, takes a time from time to time. But in this case, uh, it was not possible for me to un uh, to equip my undersuit. If this happens, you just have to go back to menu. And just start the game again. So just go back to visit location. And here we go. Let's have a look if our undersuit is active. It looks good. Let's have a look onto the helmet. Yeah, great. The helmet is here. This was my short workaround for the missing head tutorial. If you liked it,
the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Your insurance claim has been sent. Please visit us again.
can't anyone put things back where they found them? It's not my job to pick up after you. Pretty much everything we got. This doesn't look like Battlefield. Did I actually leave it on Battlefield? Oh damn, I did. My bad. Hopefully you're having more luck than me. Didn't even realize I never updated to 3715 and now I have an hour download because my internet's trash. Oh, no. Uh, yes. I, I guess I am because my download finished quite fast. Inventory concerns me. Their doors concern me more. That's like the most concerning. I know it's twenty points of one gun. Uh, I fear their doors more than anything. That and their asteroids. <laughs>
you gotta work tomorrow? That's a bummer. Welcome to the ADOT vehicle retrieval system. Your insurance claim has been sent. Wait. Your insurance claim has been sent. Your vehicle has been moved to our storage facility. Visit us again. Goodbye. Um, hello? Is, is this the nest party? Hello? Nice for yellow under suit. Oh, oh. system vehicle selected stand by what do i think need for speed a bit more arcadey initially Your than i really prefer but i've been enjoying it i like the single player but i most certainly don't like that you have to start all over for the multiplayer and the multiplayer multi playing seems rather lacking like, I was driving around, and there's, like, you're limited to eight people, no matter what. Whether they're your friends or whether they're randoms. But also, like, <laughs> you either do events with them, or you, quote-unquote, street race without any, like, indicators, as far as I could tell. I tried to race somebody, but it was literally just us, like, honking at each other. And then driving around. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Yeah, I'm I'm liking the single player. Single player. It's uh it's enjoyable in the fact that for me it is uh, arcadey enough that I jump in, I do a race. And you know, that's that. I don't have to I don't have to try hard really. Which <laughs> I know is kind of like the opposite of a racing game, but sometimes I like to just drive.
Yeah, weight and drivetrains and suspensions and all those things. In more realistic racing sims. I mean, there is some modulation on Need for Speed, but I didn't really get into it very much because it didn't seem to really drastically affect the car itself. Like, I got the Volkswagen Beetle for shits and giggles, but, uh... <laughs> But, uh, it didn't really improve it much. Yeah, and I, I like the arcade raciness. For me, that's like, like I said, I jump in, I do a race, and, you know, that's that. As opposed to, like, uh, even the crew, like, had more in-depth requirements. But that, too, was on the arcade side of the racer sims. I did do, uh... What was that Formula One game? It's like super, super intense. Like you have to buy a subscription to it. I don't remember what it's called, but I did it for a while. And that thing was, <laughs> it was like Star Citizen. You spend like 20 minutes preparing. No, not a set of course. Eye racing. That's it. Yeah. I did that and that was insane. But yeah, that was a little too much for me. I was like, okay, this this is this is not something I'm going to continue. Rally. I think I've tried that, but I don't even think it was at my own house. I think it was like a friend who had happened to have the game. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Sim games are great. Yeah. I had a racing wheel for a long time. I still have the wheel itself, but uh, the springs and my pedals broke. Like the plastic. There was a little plastic lip that held the spring in place. And that snapped off. Ironically, not when I was using it, but when I was moving it. I was just like, I picked it up, set it down gently, and then I hear this twang and then my pedal just like falls limp and I'm just like fuck uh they have um what do I have like the Thrustmaster it's like a really cheap end version of it it's meant for the Xbox quote unquote 
but it works just fine on PC. Uh, it was like the hundred and ten dollar one. I don't know. A very very like rudimentary wheel, but the wheel itself, the haptic feedback and everything feels fantastic. The only thing that uh, I would have upgraded and need to upgrade now would have been the pedals because they're plastic and they make metal ones, which I'm sure have much higher durability. But I just never upgraded to them. But now I don't have pedals, so now I think if I ever do, you know, instead of buying a whole new wheel set, I'm just gonna get better pedals. because we're on a new PC and this once I get my project car running by summer. That's my current goal for stuff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah, peripherals really, I mean, they're a great immersion experience, but they're not necessary. I'm just fortunate enough to have sticks because we're good friends. And then the the wheel I actually bought like I don't know <laughs> a long time ago when I had a job when I had money. I think the elevators are worked. Man, they really need stairwells. I would walk the stairwells if I had a chance can't hear a thing from stream wait what are you trying to hear like you can't hear the game I will you to work.
Nobody's near me. Damn it. What the fuck are people supposed to do if they're stuck here? Elevators ain't working, bro. They reset my mic. the back bay out. Nice. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, good luck getting out of that. It's not working. What? Piece of shit. Cool. Good job. Is the, where's the back way? Hey man, hey, do you know the other way out? They have to go to a landing pad somewhere. I don't remember. Yeah, you gotta go to the airlock that's over around the corner here, and then spacewalk to the uh, landing to the landing dock. I don't know if you want to do it. It's like ten minutes, like fucking, you know, EBAing or whatever you call it. <laughs> Lead the way. It's not ten minutes, like five minutes. Exactly like the best route to get there, but I can get us there. It's over this way more. Yeah, it's definitely gonna take like five minutes at least. Alright, so we gotta go down here, buddy. I'm coming. <laughs> We gotta go down here. Yeah, yeah. All the way down here. And there's gonna be another door over here by some stairs. There's... I think we go this way. Yep, here's the doorway. Alright, now we're outside. Oh, nice. Cool, that was easy. So now it's like probably like a five minute journey from here. We gotta kinda I think head like towards the right. 
You just wrap around by a uh, a landing pad. Nice. I got somebody headed this way to pick me up, anyways. Oh, nice, nice. Thanks for showing me out. Yeah, no problem, man. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. Do, 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 do. Oh, and there we go. Yeah, that wasn't bad at all. Yeah, no, that was. You know what? When I did it earlier today, bro, I took some crazy route, and it took me like five, six minutes. Nice. Oh, you can even get in the airlock here. Nice. Even better. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yep. Yep. Oh shit. Oh shit. I just fucked myself up. That was a rough landing. Coming in hot. Oh jeez. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. A little, little rough landing for me. Hey, uh, that's okay. That's way better than the freaking elevators. <laughs> Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Whoops, wrong Stand vehicle. By. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Please I did not want again. that. Welcome <laughs> to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the Please following location. Again. Welcome. Goodbye to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. That's what I want. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Welcome. Now that you're free, I wish you the best of luck. I'm going to try to sleep before your we return. Oh, okay. To the Enjoy your evening. Thanks for dropping in, of course. We'll have to... We'll get some racing in here soon enough. I haven't really progressed on this, the, the multiplayer in hopes that we will be on a similar level when we do play. I feel like I've met that guy before. Like, I've heard his voice before. Open sesame? Oh 
Did I jump? I forgot how to play. <laughs> how to fly. Damn, 15 second cooldown on the jumps.
Neutralize health scheme, what?
Hello.
Welcome to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval System. Please visit us again. Goodbye. I'm sorry. That no vehicle has been hurt or seriously impacted. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Welcome to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval System. Welcome to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval System. Your insurance claim has been sent. Your vehicle has been moved to our storage facility. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the Please following location. Again. Goodbye. Here to launch.
to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Hello, and welcome to Riker Memorial Spaceport. Your insurance claim has been sent. Thank you. Now arriving.
now arriving. Now arriving.
Munch can, it's nine o'clock. Brush your teeth, wash your face. Pass. Thank you. Seven.
Why does my character look drunk? Oh, I'm about to. continue waiting passengers should be mindful of the platform that now approaches strong winds can arise suddenly Connection trams across all major commercial areas of Arcot. City flights is business travel made simple. Tram now approaching.
now arrived. Yo. Hey, how you doing, Ryu? Doing great. How are you? Doing all right. How's that Laranite mining going? Oh, I'm not mining the Laranite. I'm just, are you just running it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> nice. I'm doing awesome. I'm horrified of a 30k coming in and wiping out like a fifth of my money, but you know that is what it is. <laughs> isn't it? One of the reasons I'm so skeptical about doing trading runs because I started doing that when I first started playing. And this was like back in like 3.0. Mm -hmm. Not even, uh, probably before then too. Uh, it was even less stable. And so you really were just playing, you know, roulette with that. Oh yeah. I, well, I've never really cared about the money I have because normally I can sustain myself at least for at least one ship, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, I always just ended up Full on, like, as much as I can, as far as I can, for as much money as I can, and, like, 90% of the time, I'd never make it. Oh, man. Do you do single point runs, or do you, like, pick up a little here, a little there, a little there? I like, oscillate between two uh, stations, two mining stations very close to each other. And, um, oh, okay. yeah, I just spend the time between just, like, grabbing any weird armor sets I find in the stations. Yeah, the red boxes, they tend to have some good stuff. Oh, yeah. I got some uh, Mandalorian helmets. I got some uh, fucking overlords. I got cat helmets. I don't know why there are so many. I have yet to get one of those. No shot. I have like eight. Uh, do you have a blue one? Or uh, blue? Most, yes. I've, I've got mostly blue ones and then one pink one. I mean, if you don't mind sharing... Oh, absolutely. I got you, my guy. Give me one second. I Let me can just give you like a hundred grenades. A <laughs> uh, hundred what? Grenades. You, you can keep those. Speaking of gambling, those are little grenade or roulette balls of death. I love using them because of that purpose. That and very few people actually use them, so very few people expect them. I actually uh, I joined a player organization, um, like a, a very military centric one. Mm -hmm. And they are super into, like, orc standard having grenades on every person. And I'm not okay with it. I guess I, I'd make money there because it'd be like, hey, you need a grenade? <laughs> <laughs> Open my coat pocket. Like, ah, I got plenty. Yeah, that's why I started my own org. I, was, I didn't want to... I didn't want it to be super serious, but once once Star Citizen actually becomes something with many loops, then I'll probably start actually being a leader. But for now, it's just a bunch of people who just like. You, uh, I'm sorry. You are very quiet, Ryu. Yeah, I keep looking away from my mic. I'm sorry. Oh, you're good. Um, yeah, it's 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 not even that like they're super serious it's just like the org leader has a very specific defined vision of what he wants it to be and i think it's a little too intense for me so i'm not sure how long i'm gonna end up sticking with it well i mean there's room in mine Good and to know. I, from what i understand you can be in multiple as long as you know the org is okay with it i don't care if people are in multiple Gotcha. Good to know, good to know. I'm not entirely sure how far I'm willing to take org play, you know? Yeah, that's why I did what I did. I was like, we're going to be a bunch of people who get together, and if there's events and things, we'll organize whatever around that. But for the most part, it's just a bunch of friends just getting on and causing mm, Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Like Siege of Orison, like, when those things get released, they're like, all right, all right, everybody, let's gather up. Let's do it on, you know, two Saturdays from now. Kind of deal. Yeah, Siege was very surprisingly soloable. 
<laughs> most of their events were, <laughs> unfortunately. Uh, I didn't get to do many of them because my computer kept crashing uh, now. Yeah. Every time I wanted to to do them. It's insane that they decided to, you know, put a new event onto Orison, the planet that crashes everybody's systems, and also the planet with the least amount of stuff on it relative to other planets. Yes, well, you see, the developers have, you know, top gear, so for them, the system works fine, the mission works fine. <laughs> And they probably have like a direct plug into the like the machine that they're playing the game on is just directly plugged into the game server, so they don't even have to worry about like client side stuff because the client is the server. Basically. Yeah. But I mean, their computers, the, the, the machines they're using to develop this, those things are top of the line. Oh, it has to be. I talked about it so frequently. They must be spending like hundreds of thousands every patch on just bleeding edge technology to test their 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 systems. Or their games. What they need to be doing is buying those old i7s, you know, 980, 1080 Ti's, <laughs> testing it on those. Yeah. That's where the real man suffers. No, don't be testing on those. It's already hard enough to get a semi-okay graphics card without fucking big game studios just scooping those up on mass too. Any hoosies, what have you been hey, up hey. to these past few weeks? Uh, not a lot. Just pretty much streaming, applying to jobs, doing all the things that a parent does. Oh, you're a dad? Yeah, I am. Oh, that's fucking sick. Sorry. I... And on that topic, I <laughs> actually need to go tuck in. <laughs> so I am going to be right back. You got it. And that goes for you too, chat. I'm streaming, by the way. Oh. Hi, chat. I'm not sure how many of you are there, but, uh, hello. Oh, man. I'm putting on this. He put me on the spot. I've, I'm not, I'm not a streaming personality. I'm just some guy. I can't even see what you guys are saying. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are having a good day, you know, just good night wherever you are in the world, whatever time it is.
Welcome back. All right. You said you wanted a star kitten helmet, right? Yes. I got one that is just silver with blue lights. Well, I have three of those. And then I have one that is pink with blue lights. All right. Yes, sir. All right. Then I'll come to you with them. Uh, where you at? Our corp. All right, I'm on Hurston, so I'll make my way to you. Oh, it's the Mark 10 series. The the um, they look like um, Spartan armors. Same server, were you? Uh, yeah. <laughs> I think parties work across them, so I've got no idea. I just put something in chat. Oh, yeah. Ooh, we're in different parties then. Or different servers then. So oh, I Either. We were in the same one. Huh. That's all good. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm not going to be on for too much longer because it's pretty late for me. I'm just going to finish oh. up that trade run. But um, Yeah, I, I just woke up. <laughs> fair, fair. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's like 5.30 here, but, like, woke up at, like, 4. <laughs> my sleep's fucked. <laughs> well, like, my partner's in New York, so, like, my time's just completely fucked. Uh. Yeah. That's, that's cool. And I met somebody in Florida the other day, and I'm just like, yeah, all of the West Coast makes time management a lot easier. Wait, East? Oh, 
global chat. Dang. Yeah. Oh, enjoy the invites. <laughs> oh. Oh, gosh. I'm so glad I haven't done that yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the fucking the whole tab to change through channels and it changing you sometimes is just really annoying. Oh. <laughs> oh, I've got so many ships, I have no idea what to use anymore. <sighs> I have so many. Somebody like rolled me. Whoa. Oh, I own three, I think. The Titan, the Cutter, and. The fuck was the third one? I have to go check, I don't actually remember. <laughs> I was thinking of buying the Hall A. Um. Oh, I really want the C. The A is kind of ugly, but I'll take I'll take an A. I'll take a I'll take an A for now. Uh, yeah, and honestly, it looks better. I think the the whole A just feels too thin, and the same with the uh, and the base freelancer also feels too thin. I like. See, I want something like a literal cargo ship, like the ships they have in Orison. Um, those things are really freaking cool, and like standardized containers and shit. Like, yes, please. What's the uh, um? What's the the raft? The I don't know which company builds those, but the raft is Argo. like really yeah. The Argo, all of the Argo trade ships. Look yes. So cool. Yes, and I also like uh the Caterpillar as well as a nice one. Uh, I really like the Drake. We're not gonna bother fleshing this out with like fancy shit because it is an industrial vehicle, and it's really nice. Held together with duct tape and a prayer. Uh, I mean, yeah, but it's like comparing a yacht to like a freaking a barge. Yeah, like, a barge gets shit done. A yacht's just for looking fancy. <laughs> oh, that's it. The C A R, the Cutter, and the Titan. Those are my ships. Um. That's the rescue Pisces, uh, right? Yes. I got it when it was on a war bond deal, and I was like, fuck, I can't pass this up. It's fucking awesome. <laughs> and, like, a med bed for tier 3 injuries? Fuck yeah. It's the best starter you can get these days, easily. Yeah. Can you regen a T3s? Uh, no. No, no, no. And tier 2s are only a for now thing until we get bigger hospital ships. Um, so the... the yeah, the Carrick uh -huh. and the 890 are tier 2s, and you can respawn at them for now, but that those features probably aren't going to stick either. Um, it'll probably be the Apollo and the bigger ships that are going to have respawn capabilities, which will be really nice. Oh. I left Hurston without actually grabbing the helmet. It's still in the local inventory. That's my bad. Oh. Just come to Everest and pick up a helmet here? Uh, no, it's a specific helmet. You can't buy it. Oh. Wait, D Dr. Flyer was asking for enough money to buy a big ship they could multi-crew, and they have an M2. They have a big ship they could multi-crew. Uh, I don't think they lost that money. <laughs> Hello. Hey, what up? Hey. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm uh just leaving the uh Plaza.
my character was doing the thing like I was suffocating. Oh, that's always fun. And I was, like... Yeah, we're just standing there and all of a sudden, out of nowhere, it just started suffocating. Oh. Yeah, luckily they didn't do that when I woke up, so... everybody oh pretty freaking close Got the helmet. Yay! I'm gonna head to y'all, I guess. Oh, shit, please don't spawn in the ground again. Oh. He's in Hangar 10, right? I think it was 10, yeah. Okay. Almost there. I'm just getting off the train, so... Oh, yep. the ass paint on this. I've wanted to see this paint in game so bad. Yes. It is my favorite paint they have in the game because black and orange is my favorite color scheme. And mm, If I had some money and I wasn't such a poor boy, I would buy this. That's that's sexy. I uh I upgraded my uh my hornet to the saber. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. I bought one for a uh, in game. That was it's a fun ship to fly. It's it's definitely a great ship. That skin on it is. Mm. Yeah, I found out if you do uh, the hotkey, open all exterior doors and close all exterior doors, it'll open up. The same with the ones in the cargo bay. 
Oh I, yeah. It works for me if I use the hotkey. It works for me. I don't know why. Really? It does what I do with mine. And I use it on my uh my joysticks. Oh. Same thing. Opening lockers is really annoying. Like, oh. Yeah, open... CIG's CIG's <laughs> got some work cut out for him. That's for sure. Yeah, the open all on the. Oh, what was I using earlier? Oh, I forgot what I was using. I think it was the yeah. I'll take the ladder if I have to. I don't mind. Oh. You said you're at uh, area 18, right, Ryu? Alright, bet. Oh, uh, no, I just, I just left. I was refilling my ship, and it took a lot longer than I expected. Uh, I, I mean, I, I have a super fast uh, quantum, so it's not going to be too long. All right, fair. I, I also still need to relog. I haven't done that yet. The 400i has probably the best quarters out of all the ships. Yeah. I honestly have fallen in love with the 100i's engines. It, I they sound so mean. For its size. I haven't oh, it. yeah. Yeah, it does. Ooh, they are sexy. I was flying mine earlier, and I was enjoying it. They sound better than the uh, Avenger Titans? A hundred times better. Wow. Alright, I know what I'm getting next. They're actually really cheap in-game, too. That's why yeah, I don't like, try it. <laughs> I'm trying not to spend any more, like, actual money on the game, because everything's so cheap in-game. Like... Damn, a week of work will buy you pretty much any ship you want, it's, uh, yeah. Yeah, and then once you get higher tier rep, the money, you really can start grinding money really fast. And what, honestly, I, I have everything that I want in game, so what I've been doing is once I get up to, like, 500k, oh, as soon as I see new players in the game that are, like, trying to f grind a little bit, I just send them what I can give them, like, 400k, leave myself with a little bit for, like, fuel. Yeah, and just bring I... Just back up again. I got, I was given like 300 million, and then I I kind of bought everything I wanted and then just gave the rest away, and now I'm at 15 million. And I just keep, I don't know, people keep throwing money at me, and I don't know why. <laughs> wow. Everybody just has everything they want, and wipes happen. And... Yeah, and also, like, apparently there was, at the beginning of this wipe, there was a really easy way to make money, so... Well, they uh... also went and overpaid everybody at the beginning of the <laughs> Oh, oh, dude, fair. I love the orange trim from the freaking fridge. That is... Mm. My only gripe is that they left the stupid stairs white on the bottom. Oh. Oh, yeah, I see what you're talking about. That is... Apparently they do that for every paint. Oh, that's except, not nice. Except the one that was, like, super limited edition. Ugh. I don't remember how you got it, but it was a one-time offer. All right. I have entered the Art Corp system. I'm bedlogging now. If I could do any custom paints, this would pretty much be what like, a lot of my shit would look like black with some orange trim. If I could, I'd change it to a dark red. A red would look sexy too. Like, a beet. I have everything purple. Beet red. What do you guys think of the uh, new red? What is it? Uh, the like Lunar New Year ones? Yeah, the Lunar yeah. New Year ones. Uh. Not a fit. I mean, I, red's not my I color. I think they look better like in game than they do on the website. <laughs> well, oh, I'm not gonna buy them on the website just to see them in game and then give them and fucking melt them again. Well, I saw some people. <laughs> I went to a ship meet and there's a couple people who had them who came showed up and got that paint. So they look pretty good in game. I, I thought 30, they looked horrible on the website. I got thirty dollars credit. I might have to give them a look. Uh. You guys gone to the PTU yet? Yeah, I like it. I can't wait for salvage, and I, I love the uh, the vulture. Oh my god, 
just coming from EVE Online, that thing is just, yes! Oh, it's so good. I haven't played it yet myself, I downloaded it, so I'm gonna try it out here in a little bit, but from what I've been seeing, it looks pretty fun. I just don't want to spoil it for myself. Yeah, I just, uh, I think if there was two separate games, so I don't get my fucking hopes up about what's there and what might not come over, like, in the next update. Yeah. My, my stance on it is oh, the TU is buggy enough, I don't need to invite more of that into my life by playing on the PTU. See, playing on the PTU made me respect this a hell of a lot more. Because it actually fucking worked compared to the PTU. But also, I had less 30Ks over there, which was nice. Um, oh yeah, true. I guess they would have better server infrastructure there. And you can park ships places and leave cargo laying around for yourself to pick up later. It's real nice. Oh. I don't like to not lose any Laranite trading and losing it to oh, a 30k. Nice. Tiny little Pisces. So. Yeah, that's me. Alright, I guess I'll hop on. <laughs> Alright, I'm on your server. Ryu, where you at? We're just floating above our corp right now, I think. That. Yep. Wait, we're out of atmosphere, right? <laughs> I think so. Uh, I guess I'll find out very soon. Yeah, we are. <laughs> that would have been a way to die. Oh, God. Oh, cool. The ramp access button's still there, even though we're landing gear up. I just wasn't sure about that. I've not entered the same game zero G I have phone past you guys. Make sure you like keep yourself upwards, otherwise you're gonna have a rough landing. Oh yeah. Alright. Close those two. Go close the copper bay. Alright, put me 70 kilometers away and her L3 is like right on top of you guys, so I'm just gonna fly that way. Can you not close that from... Oh wait, there's the button for it. There we go. Alright, we're closed. And the lift's above me. Oh. Alright, I'm back. Sorry, a friend go. Welcome good. back. Are we just uh, abandoning that Pisces? Yeah, why not? Alright. I mean, it can fight. I took out a uh, Cutlass Black in it once, but uh, it's not great. <laughs> on the man. pilot. Huh? What are you doing? Oh, on the for? pilot scooter. Yeah. Uh, I like the choice of the FL 33s. Do you guys have guns? Uh, I do have a gun, yes. Yeah, I've got <coughs> one on me. We could do a bunker. I'm just gonna grind. We can do whatever y'all want. Yeah. Um, I just you want me to go grab one of my yeah. ships and be like a snub ship? I can go be a snub ship for you. I can escort. I really wish this one had one. That's I mean, there's a Pisces in. right there in front of us. You Ooh. guys. It's going a lot faster than I thought it was. Sure Alrighty. I almost always miss those notifications because I'm just like ADD, ADHD and just can't pay attention to anything. Oh, I got ADHD too. Literally everyone I've been into a Discord call with in this game has ADHD. I'm starting to see a pattern here. <laughs> uh, I think it's why we all love space games so much is because we just can just fucking zone out. focus on everything. We're but just like, could... oh my god, 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 oh my god. You can just zone out and focus on what you want to. I don't know how it works, but it's amazing. It's like, I wish I could do this in real life. It only works in this game. Yep. <laughs> This game makes me really, like, I appreciate what they're doing, and I understand. Did we just leave? Uh, yes. Yes, you did. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell is going on in chat? Oh my gosh. Oh, I would not look. I, it is not worth oh, yeah, it. Yeah. Oh god, they're already fighting. It, it's, uh, it's bad. I love it's it, man. Cool. This is my favorite, is everybody gets all butt hurt with each other and starts crying. Yeah, but they they brought they made it weirdly political. They're talking about like oh. gender issues too. Wait, Wait, what? Oh, extra, Who's talking about extra. It? Yeah, they were talking about like transgender they can't people. Separate, they can't separate 
real world from video games. Yeah. Oh. Who gives a shit, dude? Just let people live their lives. Yeah. We'll what? play the game. You just jumped to me. I tried to. I'm not sure how close I am to you or not. You're about 10 clicks. Okay, it's saying 20 yeah. million for me. Should we fly to him or should we... Yeah, let's just fly over to him. And then we'll, meet, we'll both meet up halfway with each other. So yeah, you're 13, there you are. I'll take it real Flying slow because I have no clue where you guys are. Can you not see a marker? I do, it says 30 million. you stay still? We'll just fly to you because we can see your marker. Actually, that. yeah, that's better. Yeah, no, he just jumped. What I did? the fuck? Yeah. What is I, I mean, I didn't do it on my side. I bet it's desyncing. Yeah, real fucking bad. I've not seen this before. Oh, I see your marker. Oh, there you are. That's not what I meant to do. Cab master, huh? Alright, doors are open, so if you guys want to fly up, feel free. I'm not sure if you can park inside, though. I don't know what can fit in this. And it's cargo bay. Uh, oh, this was too big of a ship. For sure. Yeah, this won't fit. Alright. This will only fit in a 890, I think. No. This ship? No, this. One sec, let me go find the spreadsheet. I parked it on top of one. Oh, you can park this on top of you. I don't think you what can. You guys well, I've tried to park. It's too big to, to get oh, stuck Oh, yeah, no. I don't think that fits in anything. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, no. The biggest is the 300 series. Damn it. That's a really cool spreadsheet for what fucking fits, and it's real nice. Uh, Here we go. We're going in. <laughs> I like it. I'm down. Let's do this. <laughs> whoa, 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 okay. All right. Let me let me make some space. I already hit. I'm gonna open up your oh the the door over here so we can uh the ramp so we can just ramp to ramp. I wish ramp ramps had ramp gravity it. in this because ramps not having gravity kind of fucking sucks. Wait, just you're... I just kind of want a first person view for this. Oh, you're moving. I am. Oh, I bumped you. It should stabilize. Love tap. Oh, let me put this away. Oh, this will be. F I gotta look at this and. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. Well, the I mean, these two ships together are big enough to we do We find some the 400i and the C2 in a mating dance. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, yeah, the wings on this would be too wide for the uh, for the 890. Why is it not? It's too long and it's too wide. What's happening? I'm just surprised, like, why I didn't. Oh, oh okay. I must have desynced. And the moment I stepped into the pilot seat, did I desync away from you guys again? No, you're uh, above us now. You kind of okay. teleported above us. Just don't go down. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not going to touch the pilot seat again. Huh. Where is he? Is he behind us? He's right above us. Oh, he's above right, us. Yes, okay. Kind of. I have the airlock open on the side and the front ramp open. But I can also open the cargo bay, whichever one you want, Bex. Do I have a track beam with me? No, I do not. Oh, I do. What do we need that for? I have a spare. You can uh, use it in space for EVA. Oh, yeah, I know that. You around. Yeah, you can also... Cool. Yeah. But also, it's just, it would be easier to throw the helmet towards you guys and have someone grab it with the tractor beam. Oh, yeah, I okay. got you. Here, so oh, you, guys are, you guys are a lot closer, actually, than I thought you were. I got out. Here. Whoa! I, I fell through the ship. Fucking hell. That's okay. Uh, I'm, shipping, I'm coming to you right oh now, Vex. Oh, God. God. There you go. That was terrifying. <laughs> you can just I let just it go of that, and you can just float on your way over. I'll take care of that box for you. Yep. It's floating. Yeah, I'm trying to get there. We go. There we go. I keep missing. All right, bet. Look at this space trade. This is Star Citizen. I'm just trading some packages. Absolutely, can see some cops pulling up like it's a drug bust just to see one, <laughs> one star one helmet. helmet. 
<laughs> oh my god, those are the best helmets. It was, real, it was worth buying that thing. Oh my gosh. Um, it's Helmet. on the subscriber store. Yeah. Package is on. Sweet. Alright, I'm gonna let you all fly away before I sit down, just in case it decides to warg me into you guys. <laughs> I'm just flying around with the uh, tractor beam. This is so fun. <laughs> I never even thought about this before. You could do a race around. All right, so you're following those specs? Oh no, I'm uh, I'm actually going to bed after this. I was planning to sign off after I finished that uh that Lara night run I was doing. Okay, sounds good. Yep. Fair. All right. Thank um, you for the helmet again. Of course. I've got a couple as well. If you ever want more, just gonna keep out for you. Awesome. Where do you want me to put the helmet for you? Oh, I'm coming to get it right now. Okay. Yeah. I have it down here in front of the elevator. Oh, there is another ship here. It is about oh, to hit. There's about to hit your ship. Oh, just barely Let's skated across them. the top. Yeah, it's not on. I don't know what it is. It looks like a fighter. Uh, uh, the door's closed. It's just spinning through space. I don't want to get in. Oh, I see. Oh, that's an arrow, isn't it? Uh, I suppose. I'll go hop in the. Uh, for I'm... just to make sure. Yeah, go target it and see what's... Make sure nobody's on board my ship, because my... Everything was open. <laughs> right? Yeah... Wait, it's oh. Blackjack security. Oh! Okay. Oh my gonna, god. I was gonna go <laughs> fucking steal it, but okay, I went to... Yes, it is just a arrow literally spinning in circles out there for some reason. I literally You can literally us. see it that like a, this. That is a police officer here to see. You scan see it out there us. to your left. You can just like zoom in, like uh, hold F and zoom in. And you can just see it out there just spinning in circles. <laughs> he's just having, he's just living his best life. He was walking up to scan this for a drug bust. He's <laughs> only going to find that star kitten helmet. What did I sell you? Oh yeah, that's they the helmet. They can see me wearing it now. I should have told me what we're doing Star Kitten helmets. I have a couple at Dark Orb. Yeah, I got yeah, three at Everest, I think, <laughs> at least. Plus one I bought, so I get one every white. Fuck yeah. You can never have enough. I love them so much. <laughs> you gonna do a BLRT? Uh, yeah, I wanted to grind some rep. Alright, I'm a pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, thank hey. you. See you, boss man. Good. See you. Um, so is this a ship bounty one or is this a bounty? Uh, it is bunker? a ship bounty. I think it's planet side. Is it? Oh, okay. So we're gonna go. Get a vehicle. Anybody have a three seater cyclone? Uh, I wish a cyclone had three seats. It's, it's good. A cyclone they can't fit an Ursa in here, can you? Good. Uh, no, no, no way. I never tried to. I didn't think you could either. I think it's, you might even struggle to fit a cyclone in here. Uh, no, I have a racing cyclone and I can fit it. Oh, cool. I know you. Can, I know it struggles to fit the one that has the, like the warthog one with like the Gatling gun on top. The turret, yeah. Oh. But, and the one with the rocket pods, but if you have the, the normal one, I think it's okay. I know it can fit okay. the STV just fine, because I did that with mine. Oh, the STV is tiny, though. Yeah, the STV fits on everything, almost. You can fit the STV really nicely in the uh, cutter. You Yeah, that's... You could, I love that. It's my, it's, my, it's my new favorite ships, dude. I use the cutter and the cutlass, like, religiously for almost everything I do in this game. I don't own a cutlass. Well, I mean, I have bought one with an AUEC, but I don't use it for anything. I had the Nomad, and I upgraded it to my, my cutting bag. And I, uh, honestly, I don't like the Nomad at all. Oh. The Nomad, I really liked it. The only reason I got rid of it is because now that, um... Cargo is going to be able to be physicalized, and it's not protected from the back. That you could literally can easily just yoink it out the back yep. of it. Yup. So, also, I, I don't like that the Nomad floats. It's just so fucking wrong within the entire universe of, of this game. I like, mean, honestly, I think about it, look, it, it. It's cool, dude, because it's it's futuristic. This game takes place in the year 2952. Oh, I know. We, we don't have... have any like cool hover mechanics like that. Well, we have we have uh, like. 
you put the amount of power that would use, we have gravity plating, but it's going to be expensive. That's true. Uh, like, like, every ship uses size gravity ship, plating. It's expensive, if you think about it. Yeah, just power-wise, it's going to cost a lot. And it just, given that everything else, when powered off, will sit on the ground, it's very weird that that thing doesn't add often. Because of that, at least to me, from a technical perspective, it feels wrong. Uh, Fair. Yeah. I don't know, I like sci-fi, but I also like science, and I'm just like, that feels... inefficient. <laughs> uh. Happen to step right on the cargo deck as you open the door. Perfect timing. That was like perfect timing. Cinematic. All I need is a little outro music. Technically, you can fit a Nox in the nose of the ship. I've done it a couple of times. You've done it before. It, that's what it's made for, isn't yeah. it? Well, it's, yeah, made, it's made for, for the, the XL1 one. thing, yeah. or whatever it's called. It's, I don't think it's the XL1. Oh, it's like the, 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 the motorbike. Yeah, it's the one that's still the prototype one. They haven't. I really, it. I really want that. I just can't wait for it to be released. Ah. Oh. Your feet dangle out the bottom of the ship. It's weird. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Yeah, so the Cyclone RC fits. That's the one I have. Yeah, the RC is amazingly fast. I wish Prison Break gave you that thing, and I don't know, a suit within it, so you could just fucking switch out to a suit. Um, yeah. Because I've done a few Prison Breaks, and I... One time I can I got fit in your car a bit, right? <laughs> yes. That's another cool part about the 100 eye, by the way, as you can spot it at these little pads. Yes, and the um, and the Pisces. Oh, the Pisces, it. both versions of the Pisces, and you can the also Talon. spawn the Talon, yeah. And the Hull well. A can be spawned here as well, which it shouldn't be able to, but it can. That, that's surprising. I didn't think you could do that. Yeah. yeah the 85X does as well. It's one of the reasons. Oh, yeah, I know the 85X can. I love the 85X. It's one of my favorite ships. Uh, I am trying to find something. This honestly, is, it's a decent little ship. I don't think it's worth the price, like, money-wise, but I think it's a Nothing cool is. Ship. Nothing is worth the price money-wise, but you can currently buy AUEC for, like, a couple dollars per hundred million. Nothing's worth There's the price There's a little, uh, <clears throat> village bay under there. Like, uh, I bought a couple hundred million, and, like... <laughs> It's like, why would I, uh, with it being that cheap, I'm just like, gosh. Alrighty. I'm actually gonna grab my 85X instead of this one, because my 85X has better guns. I'm gonna grab something. Ooh, this place is pretty. I didn't even realize mm. we'd landed, it was such a fucking smooth ride. <laughs> I was still sat in. It's like waiting for us to do something, but then I realized you were talking about sporting things. I'm like, oh shit, we probably landed. <laughs> oh. This door does not work for me. There we go. There we go. Oh, that is a nice set of armor. Okay, the black and orange, and that looks really fucking cool. It's clean. It's my favorite look in the game, like it's one of the it, best ones. It is nice. Uh, let's see, what do I want to bring here? I wish this thing had a trunk, but now that they're adding in, uh, inventories to fighters and shit for everything on all the ships in the F, what do you call it, the interactive menu? Yeah. It, that makes this ship worth it, in my opinion. I'm gonna use this ship a lot. What ship is that one? 
the 85X. It's my favorite uh, origin ship. I think it's the best one they have. Can fly one? I can spawn one for you. They're I've got, super I've got cheap. One. I've already got one. Okay. I just forgot what ship it was. For some reason, I got the 85X and the uh, M50 mixed up in my. They're brain. honestly really close to being the same ship. <laughs> Just yeah. The M50 is more dedicated to racing, but this thing can't be used for racing. It's actually pretty agile at it too. <laughs> That's cool. It's fun to use this thing in like a um, microtech under the bridge. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Right, like, you know, the bridge like under the train. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so like you use this, like there's a racetrack that they do in uh, Lorville or uh, microtech that uses the, uh, that one. It's a lot of fun. Oh, New Babbage. Yeah. I used to live at New Babbage. Hey, there's another. Oh, this thing sounds nice. Oh, it's fun, dude. This is one of the... It's clean. Origin honestly did a really good job when they did their, um... Engine noises. Holy shit, I hit like fucking 20 Gs. My god. This is insane. Oh no. This is, uh... What do you call it? The little snub shuttle ship that comes with the 890. Oh, is it? Yeah, when you buy the oh. 890 package, this is what comes with it. I think the 890 is a ship that I would only ever buy in game to say, hey, I got it. I have bought it, and I bought it for my date the other day. I think I've bought like four 890s for different people. Uh, and then. <laughs> Yeah, you know, this thing sounds real nice. Aha! They had the black and orange paint on this. Oh. It'd be nice. Just had to wait for five years for it to actually do something. Ooh. I love D Sync. Oh, yeah, it's great. <laughs> it's, yeah. Oops. So, uh, you said you fly with sticks, right? Me? Yes. Keyboard and mouse. Right, you would have you. Sticks. <laughs> yeah, I fly with sticks. You fly with sticks? Do you uh, use your ground vehicles? Do you pilot those with sticks as well? Yes and no. Yes and no. Yeah. I uh, I figured out a way to map it so I could uh, drive and everything with my um, my sticks. Well, <laughs> I it's bound and everything by default for me. I just don't my like the pre like the default bindings, so I use my keyboard for throttle and brake and boost. <coughs> and then I use yeah. like my stick for steering. Huh. My they didn't have anything that for me, so I had to do it all manually. My uh, my issue with sticks is uh, the fact that you don't fucking work on Linux most of them. <laughs> they don't work on what? They don't work on Linux. Uh -huh. Yeah, a lot of them don't just, they just don't work because it's like, everyone games on Windows and I'm like, no, not everybody. Ah, <laughs> uh, uh, oh, these things, yeah, I don't miss. I wish we could taxi around on the ground too, just like, oh, I didn't quite land correctly, let me just change that. It has wheels, it should. I know, should it's so many, so things. many ships do. <clears throat> Especially the Origin ships have wheels, and uh... It the Valkyrie also has wheels. There are tons of. I know that the Mustangs do. I know that yeah. the uh, Hornets do. Oh, the Titan does as well. The Titan. Uh, does. Yeah. The. 
I'm pretty sure it's the Valkyrie has them, and uh. I can't believe the Valkyrie has wheels for a dropship. That doesn't make any sense. I mean, if you were deploying it for a carrier, you'd want wheels. Fair. Yeah, and we're going to have carrier like ships, so it makes sense. Um. Oh my god, what was the other one? The Redeemer, I believe, has wheels as well. If, uh, really? No, the Retaliator. Give me a second. Does. Maybe the Retaliator, maybe not the Redeemer. Yeah. One sec. Uh. I don't think the Retaliator does. The Retaliator has those freaking dozen legs. Um, does it? Yes. Oh, it has goodness. tons and tons of landing gear. Um, the Caterpillar does. Oh. The Retaliator probably has about half that amount, but it's on such a small body. Uh, <laughs> let's have a look. I want to see it landed. I see what you're do. Yes. What if the Origin Retali tried to make a fighter? The Retaliator does have wheels. Interesting. Yep, those are definitely wheels. Uh... Oh, that's such a badass ship to see come flying at you, dude. <laughs> You don't see 400 eyes out very often, so when you see them, you're just like, mm. Chef's kiss. <laughs> I just heard him coming all of a sudden. There he goes. <laughs> Still got your landing gear down, it looks like. Yeah. I'm glad they don't snap don't off yet. You're talking about. I am very glad they don't snap off from uh, pressure. God, that would suck. <laughs> it's probably gonna happen. I can well, see eventually, it yeah. They're gonna yeah. do a lot of. If they do a lot of the physics they've been talking about. I can definitely see it happening. Ooh, you're hauling ass. <laughs> Make sure you hit that deck. This, this thing sounds like a damn rocket when you're just. I feel like it does pretty good in uh, ship combat too. It doesn't do a shit ton of damage, but you can uh, you can dogfight in this thing pretty well. I don't dogfight. I just sit behind targets and just. Uh, I, I, I guess that is. But generally, I just aim to just keep behind them and I just stay there. I don't bother with PvP at all. Just PvE, which is just fucking sit in one spot and shoot them. <laughs> it's just irrelative to them. Uh, I just do uh, bunkers a hell of a lot more. All right, are we bunkers. actually gonna go to the? Yeah, yeah, we can go. I'm just chill. I'm just waiting to figure out exactly what we're doing. Yeah, I'm just like yeah. yeah. You get me. I was listening. Oh, that's me targeting. Sorry. I was just okay. Curious. <laughs> oh, hello. Uh, I thought for a second I saw somebody else here. Didn't sure mean to some interrupt. I was just curious. Oh, we can go through you. I'm down. Cool. What? I didn't know for sure if it was in uh I grabbed this one just in case it wasn't. Like it's a ship. The ship, so we have a uh, more firepower for it in case. We could do one of those. Do you guys have high level? Well, the uh, the VLRT That's... is a ship to ship. I'm pretty sure. I've got some higher higher level ones. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna drop off my gear if we look high level ones. Uh... I've got all the way up to ERTs. I'm actually gonna drink some water. My character Where is this uh, bounty at again? For some it's reason, a, I don't security have a depot. It's on the other side of the planet. Security depot, what Make one? sure you're tracking the mission. I have it tracked, but I don't have the marker on my screen. I'm just gonna jump to you guys. It's the other side of the planet, no? Um... Or whatever this means that we're at. We are, oh. but I. You're still right next to me. I've got um, a track, but I can't see. I'm water so my character doesn't die. Where the fuck is the box? What? It's tracked, but I can't see. What? 
Well, I'll just because it's his mission and he shared it with us. That's probably why we can't see it. I'll just jump there and then you can jump to me. Yeah. Because I couldn't see it on the map either. It's ridiculous. Nope, wrong scene. Not sure what's going on, but I think my game just broke again. For a second, his ship survived. Oh. <laughs> no, but I left the engines on, so I thought they spawn in the air. Maybe it hit. I just saw it hit the deck. I followed it to the floor, and I'm checking to see if there's like a just in case it had like your body. I can catch your armor for you and bring it back. Oh, I couldn't really help it anyway. <laughs> it fell to the to the moon. My shit fell to the moon. Any, like wreckage from your body here. So hopefully your body like um kept the stuff. Like it clipped out of the ship before it crashed. That's what my hope is for you. Well for me I was still in space. Wait, I watched your ship fall all the way down to the planet. <laughs> you should have said something. <laughs> I might have been able to say it. I'm Give me two seconds, we'll be right there. Oh, oh missile. Missile. Fuck. It on. That is a lot um, Holy shit. Are you still on the, uh, 85X? Yep. Okay, give me two seconds, I'll be there. You oh, have gimbals, by the way. Of... Oh, that's fine. I don't need them. I'm just letting you know, just in case you want them, it has gimbals. Yeah, I just use fixed all the time. I'd... Honestly, I've spent so long without using gimbals that using them throws me off now. Same. Because I didn't know how to use them for like the first week and a half. I'll only use them for big fat slow ships like the Connie. That's fair. Just because it turns like a brick. Alright, I'm coming Oh, this thing now. just has no missiles. Okay. Yeah, it, it's just supposed to be a snub ship. Oh, shields are gone. Okay. Well, that was quick. <laughs> She's fragile. Right, Done. Go. Uh -huh. <laughs> it was just gone. I'm like, okay. I think we're supposed to go in. Oh, oh it's too red. Oh, were they flying? Yeah, there's one left. I got him. I got him. Yep. Yeah, it can scrap, dude, especially at lower bounty levels. Uh, wait, what did they walk for? Oh, the base right there. So That's me. Oh. Oh. I'm 
All right. Well, thanks for joining. For sure. Yeah. I'm stuck inside my hospital room. Oh God! I can. I don't know. My game is lagging hard again. I think I need to restart my computer. Like memory leak style. But I get. I lost my cat on it. Damn it. Aw, oh, did you really? Yeah. I'll bring you another one. What color do you want? Uh, just a surprise me. Alright, I'll bring you an extra one. I'm gonna restart my computer. I'll be right back. Hello? Huh? <clears throat> Alright, let's try this again.
Not to drown And on the surface I had it together But underneath I saw it came around Where would I be? You're all that I need My world, baby, you hold me down You always hold me down No I've been a breaker and broken Every mistake touched the moments Wouldn't take anything back I still love you, Darcy You look just like me I respawned. Alright. You know where you spawned at? <laughs> Not yet. Port Tressler. Port Tressler. Alright, so you're over in Microtech. <laughs> I guess so. <laughs> I just trashed that underseat. I'm trying to find it for kitty cat. Pink. I've got a blue one. Want pink or do you want blue? Hmm. So much ammo. They should have got all the guns. Whoa. Okay. I don't remember having all of this, but I will accept it. Do you have? Oh, just a station full of random shit. Spoils from Morris. I just don't remember storing this many here. Just 
I am wearing what looks like yeah, like I found what it found lying around. Oops. I have winter pants. Uh, what is it? The area 18? No, not the area 18, but the the soldiers. Like that microtech wears. Oh, nice. ADP arms white is what it says. And then just a jumpsuit. It looks so ghetto. It's great. I'm living the life. Me and my yacht. Don't mind the yacht. Uh, Make sure you have line of sight. Well, I'm trying to set like a uh, route to you in the map, or just a microtech in general, and it just does not want to let me set there. It goes, okay. I had to jump to an OM marker, and then everything we set it to work afterwards. I've got six minutes on my ship. Ship you're gonna fly? 400. Sounds good. What do you want to go do? Uh, well, since it's just the two of us, let's do some planet side racing. Planet side racing? I'm down. Yeah. Let's grab some Noxes and we'll just land somewhere random. And go from point A to point B. That works for me. Honestly, something I really enjoy. I do this with everybody. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Do we take them like? Should I grab like my cutlass or something? I can go pick up so we can like pick up our stuff and take them somewhere. Or? They can both fit on the four hundred. Okay. But. Actually, yeah, bring something that can, that can fit it. Because if you land and I land, we can race to one and fly back to the other. That works, yeah. So we'll put both of them in mine. And then you just, you're going to be point like the destination. And then I'll just land somewhere else. And that will be the starting point. I'm already jumping to you. So hang on. I have an idea. Well, microtech works. We can just go from here. Yeah, I'll just meet you. I'll just have to claim a ship over there, but that's fine. To in a ship? <laughs> yeah, actually. Oh, you mean like something to carry? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, something I mean, to carry. And a cutter can carry it. Don't you have a cutter? Yeah, but I'm in my Harbinger at the moment. I just had that was ready. At uh, Area 18, I was like, I like opened the terminal. It was like one of the first ships I saw that was ready. I was like, like cool, I'll take that. Which one was the Harbinger? The yeah, Vanguard. That's the one with the uh, size five torps on it. Oh, the bomber? Yeah. Bomber variant. Okay. When I saw the... Uh, like, I, I haven't even thought of it. Like, how is that? It's a little bit slower, I guess. Like, barely slower than the other ones. But it's got a little bit more whole HP. And then it has um, more missiles. So it has a... A lot of different missiles, and you have the size five corpse, and they hit hard. Yeah, the size nines are fantastic. Size nines are disgusting. I've been victim of a bombing run. Yeah, I'm just I've been a victim watching of the both A2s in the distance, too. and then the next one landing on me was fantastic. I had a friend who was like, I don't get why people like eclipses. I think they're kind of dumb, blah, blah, blah. Isn't that kind of lame doing all that? So I made him take mine. I sent him on an ERT. And he goes, oh, this is why people like them. 
<laughs> I was like, yeah, I know it's easy. It's the satisfaction that is just... Mm. Just doing a drive-by and watching you one-shot it is just... There's nothing better. Mm -hmm. Do you know how many players it takes to shake it? It's got to be a shitload. It depends on how far. And then... Um, if they use the EM one, it's like almost impossible to shake it unless you're like anticipating it or you're moving really fast. I think a smaller, like the 600i to maybe, you know, the. Not you have a lower EM signature, you have a better chance of dodging right. it. I can't but remember you how you're be supposed using to drop EM signatures. Would you? What's up? I said you wouldn't be using it on little fighters, would you? Oh no, that you want to use a size. You could, but you'd want to use a size nine on like a. Like bigger. realistically, can the size nine target a fighter just as well as a size two or three? It realistically probably not with the speeds, but like, could it in theory hit? Yes. I'm talking game mechanics. Did they make it so that's possible? Because can you just go take out little fighters with those things <laughs> and everything around it? I mean, I've seen like because people take eclipses out for bounty runs, and they on purposely uh like and other people will be in like fighters and they'll just come in with like stealth with like the shields off and all that kind of shit. And then um, Like they can't be detected and they shoot the EM missile before they get like the torp before the other guys get a chance to even really even react and they're popped. But if like it's a dog fight and you try to shoot at them while they're going full speed. No, not a dog not. fight. No, I'm thinking bombing them just like you would with the capital costs. I'm just curious if people do that, if they take out their eclipses and specifically to take out little fighters. Some guys, yeah, like, they oh, purposely do it just because they can't take him out. Like, they can't dogfight, so how they take out bounties is they pull out their... <laughs> yeah, eclipses. I'm just curious if, like, a little Gladius could outrun or outmaneuver a size 9, or if it's I bet you could. I honestly guarantee you, like, guys. if you watch, like, Avenger 1 or something like that, I bet he's got a video on how to, how to dodge him. <laughs> he knows how to dummy fire them. He actually can like do it. He can dummy fire a fucking twerp and hit a target without even having a missile lock on him. Oh yeah. There's a lot of good people out there. Well, not good, but like good players. <laughs> so where did you? Where did you end up going? Uh, I'm still waiting for my shit to spawn. Where are you? Port Trestler. Welcome. Port Trestler? Why do I not see your uh, my icon? Oh, there you are now. Okay. Your icon wasn't there, and all of a sudden, as I'm quantuming to Port Trestler, your icon showed up. Yeah, but either way, I was just curious if people took eclipses out for smaller ships, or if they knew that smaller ships would evade. Maybe player bounties, but like if it was uh like just. BLR, like small bounties, it's kind of a waste. How much do they cost to restock? It is expensive. <laughs> That's probably why not. Then. But what some people like to do on purpose is they just, uh, as soon as you deplete the three, they just hold back space to self destruct the ship and just get a free restock. I mean, yeah, it's... It's the, yeah, it's basically people kind of abusing mechanics. I didn't like that. I paid the fine. I seriously, seriously thought about getting the Retaliator instead of this. I'm honestly going to do that next time, just because it holds six. The only thing I don't like about it is, once again, one of my biggest concerns was I want something where I can host people, enough people, whether or not they have a station or not. But I also want something that I can fly and manage by myself. Agreed. And the Retaliator didn't cut it because it doesn't have anything slave to the pilot in terms of armaments. 
Yeah, all you have is your missiles. Right. Which That's, wasn't worth it for me. So, not yeah. only that, but after I saw the black and orange paint, I was just like, oh, that's so sexy. I'll no, do the 400 eyes purchase. paint. That's, that's the, one of the best paints. I think the three ships that have some of the best paints in the game is the, what do you call it, the Scorpius with the, the Sunbird mm -hmm. one. They have like that Tiger. white, orange, yep. and whatever. Yeah, one. that one's a great one. Um, the Redeemer has a really good one with the... Um, it's a little orangish one, the Valencia. I used to have the Nomads, the orange one I had. I thought it was pretty good. I don't know the Nomads or the other one you just mentioned. And there's one more that has a really good orange. Or at least that I liked a lot. It's a good paint. I love, I love the fact that this was a two-tone black and orange. And I'm a big Red Panda advocate. And I like Red Pandas. They're just like these adorable little fluff balls. Right. And they're endangered, so like people need to be aware of these little things. <laughs> um, so their colors are a scheme that I've always enjoyed, regardless of who they are. But uh, it just happened to match up, and I was like, so like dark colors. I like dark tones. Two tonal colors are great. Black and red would have been my preferred, but this was just the closest I found. I like it. All right, so we need a mining station. Where is the closest one? Take a moon. We're on Babbage. We may as well race here. Oh, yeah, we can do Babbage. Okay, or so microtech. Shubin Mining Facility SM022. So SM022? Yeah. Okay, that'll work. But no, it looks like zero. I'm only calling it SMO. It might not be an SMO. What is this? What does it stand for? Shipping mining operations? That makes sense. Okay, so it would be now. Yeah. Oh, I gotta crash into the station through war. Wow, that was uh. I don't think I can fit my cyclone and the cutter, so I'm to cut. No, we're doing this. Or do you want to do cyclones? Can a Nox fit in a cutter? Mm, yes, a Nox can fit in a cutter easy. I haven't tried. You can fit many vehicles into the cutter. I know I can do a mule, but like. It Nox is great. smaller than the Dragonfly, if that gives you an idea. Yeah, I'll just take the cutter. We'll try it, why not? I can't see the ground and I'm very scared. Like, TV, I can fit a cutter. Or, uh, Nox. It'll be a tight fit with the, uh... I guess if you put a Nox diagonally, it might be the same thing. Well, I bet if I leave the door open, it'll be fine. Yeah, you have to quantum over. But I can quantum over and I can pick the Nox up from the, uh... Right, but if we're racing to you, you need to be able to carry two Noxes. This looks like it, yeah, I think I could fit a Nox in here. Can you fit two? Because we're racing to you, so we need to fit two. For the return trip. Right? Wait, aren't you gonna have your Nox and I'll have my Nox? Right. We load them both up into my vehicle. You go park somewhere. I park somewhere. After I pick you up from where you park. And that's. What I can do also is I can just drive my Nox over the, the starting point and we can just go from there. That would take forever. Maybe oh, that's I, true, I yeah. have something in mind. Don't worry. We need two vehicles that can carry two buses. Mm. I'm not sure this can fit two Noxes. You have something bigger? Yeah, I got something bigger. This is going to have to reclaim it really quick. A Cutlass? you have a Cutlass? Yeah, I got a Cutty. Yeah, do one of those. Yeah, I'm going to go grab that really quick. Or a Freelancer? I have a Freelancer. I've got a Cutty. I typically have a... 
MSR, but the MSR has been bugs. I have been I use Freelancer for eight years. I I used it for a bit, and then I got an MSR and I stopped using it. Yeah, so back in 2012, I purchased the Freelancer. It was like the biggest ship at the time. <laughs> I don't know if you realize, but that was like literally the biggest ship. Oh, I know. I've been. I went back and looked at all the. the I've been. Hit, I went to look at the history of the game to kind of. I was like, damn, this game has actually come quite a bit. I'm quite far in love. Yeah. So I bought that, and as so it wasn't even flyable at the time. But as soon as it became flyable, it's the only ship I've used for like the last, or for eight years approximately. Well, I finally upgraded to the Dur. I love the Dur. This is an even better version of the standard. And then I upgraded to the Max, and I was very disappointed that I could not upgrade back to the Dur because they were the same price basically at the time. Literally equal. But it wouldn't let me change it. It's dumb. But the Max is great. Yeah, hauling vehicles. Woohoo. But I like the, the range on the Dur. Like, you never had to stop ever to refuel. That's nice. That's also what I really like about the cutter right now, even though I know they're gonna fix it. The cutter at the moment has way too much fuel. I believe it, yeah. Like, I think it has 6,000 quantum fuel. And the Dura like, had two computers, two medium computers, which is oh, that's cool. amazing for ships those size. People want to say that the Freelancer is in the same class as this this 400 <laughs> honestly like, like no. <laughs> I don't have a problem <laughs> with miss ships you know what I mean but I feel like every other company has something that's just a little bit better mm -hmm. and you're just like man like I just wish you guys as ships just had a little more um just like one or one one or two amenities of life could make a huge difference. It could make a ships. big difference on those ships, yeah, and I feel like a lot more people would want to use them if they were like that. 30 seconds. I've honestly been debating on upgrading my Cuddy Black to a Cuddy Red. I know a lot of people who have been doing that. Going into 318, I think it might be a smart idea. Because I don't do too much cargo running. But. I don't like to mine. You can put an STV in the back of the Cuddy Red. Medics do not have safety That's in Pyro. It's going to be. The only other good part about <laughs> it, I guess, is it's convenient for like. Uh, like it's convenience for you as a solo player because you just have the med beds and you can play on them whenever you need to like refill your oh yeah like your hydration and stuff like that but do you really need two beds then you don't need two beds which is honestly <laughs> why I s and then you're i'm gonna be able to buy a cx8 and 318 in the store anyways the med pisces so it, it might not even be worth it I get it for its size and its durability, maybe, over the Pisces. If I had to choose between the two, I would choose the Cuddy or Cutlass for that purpose only. I'd be like, oh yeah, this thing will tank a lot more. Yeah, I forgot. I have two Cutlasses because I own one, and I had one in the game like way back at the beginning of this patch. It's like, this is my loadout that I had on my Cuddy. You said you're at Shubin, right? Mm -hmm. 22. Okay. I'm just leaving Trussler now. I don't have a backpack, so I can't carry any of his loot. Put it in local, and then put it in your ship's inventory. Oh, yeah. That is a concept. That's the good part Ooh. about mining stations. Oh, blue. Or gold. I'll take the gold. Wait, no, I need to change my health for that. Get rid of this one. Put these on. Mm -mm. Get rid of these. This one. Should I be able to see your marker? Yeah. 
You should be able to, but it, can it's be. probably it's not going to let me. Oh yeah, I'm looking to fly now. <laughs> to the planet. Oh, I'm not going to even let me jump to you. I'm just going to have that. Jump to the your party member marker, but let me jump to the actual Shiva marker. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know why. Well, I might need to grab a check and see if they have the water in one of those containers there. Oh, I got plenty on me. Get dehydrated. There's also still plenty left inside me. Normally, I always keep like one on me, as like I might, just in case. I usually keep like six or seven on me. I'm prepared for any situation. Not really, but I like to think I am. Same. Honestly, I try to pretend like I have like prepared for when I go out, but I try not to be like too prepared. Yeah, I don't bring anything I care about. Yeah, all the stuff Typically, I care about. Except I for the behind. cat helmet, but that was inevitable. I got another one for you, don't you worry. I don't use the cat helmet, I have looted them and I just have them just because. I do that with everything else, I just have them found them, surprisingly. It had to be dark here, didn't it? Mm-hmm. It's very windy. Minus oh, four three Celsius. I don't know how my character's not cold in the outfit that I'm wearing. But hey, you can go to it. Some really good undersuits. I want one of these. System. All right, what was I grabbing? Oh, yeah, my cycle. No, Nox. Nox, Nox, Nox. Your insurance claim has been sent. Your vehicle has been moved to our storage facility. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Storm is going to blow my Nox away as soon as it spawns. I just can't. Your vehicle has been delivered to the Since location. it's going to be uh, powered off. That's what they'd like you to think. But <laughs> how complete is this game? Fair. Fair, fair, fair. I've had plenty of vehicles just get blown away. Um, that's another... Oh, hey, how's it going? Hey, hello there. That's the end. Profesh. I've been practicing.
You better get in there. I'm gonna run you over. You do it. to stay under 20 but you have 20 to altitude. stay you have to stay like yeah super super low like you have to weave in that between the trees <laughs> that on the Damar rally oh damn that would be the slowest race ever that would be the slowest race of all time it might even be slower than the golf course and they have really bad stability I actually oh want to try that with the uh, 318. I want to go on the PT and try that go kart race. It's so fun. It's honestly one of the more enjoyable things of 318 that I've I played the PT. Am I putting this on yours, or am I going to put this on mine? No, you're putting it on mine. I just got it. I'm going to take this up first, and then park mine. Yeah, okay. What I'll do is I'll just park this one right here. I don't think I can spawn another one of these, but what I'll do is I'll put a hover quad on mine. Or I could put, okay. like, a, a cyclone or something on it. No, because we need we need it to be empty so we can fit both of these in there. You're the end, like you're the finish line. Okay, so you want to put this one on that one, and then we'll. Okay, I know what you're talking about now. That and makes then a lot of sense. We're gonna fly away on mine, land, and that'll be the starting line, and then from the starting line, you race to yours, land on yours, fly back to mine, and start over. That works. Or whatever. Got to turn the ship off. That's a good thing, the uh, 400 eyes. Such a sturdy ship. Oh, yeah. Man, I love this thing. It's so good. Once everything in this is fully operational, can you, it's just going to be a glorious ship. That's going to be a, it's going to be a bitchin' ship. Hey, perfect. Just when I need to cruise. Oops. I'm going to take one more. I'm just inside getting a drink. Racer carrier can just park them super tight. Systems activating. Systems on. Well, that storm was going away for a second. Why is power low? external lockers on the cutty black to actually stay consistent and stop bugging out <laughs> a lot of ships need their lockers reworked yeah as soon as they actually work i'll be i'll be a happy person toss those on the ship i honestly don't need those
Ready? Yeah. First of all, let's go to the sunny side. Agreed. Do you fly couple or do you fly decoupled? I dogfight with decoupled to move, basically. But otherwise, I fly coupled. Nice. Or if I need to do really fast maneuvers, I decouple. Yeah, it like depends emergency. on what ship I'm flying, <laughs> honestly, for me. Like, if I'm flying fighters or like really, really good handling ships, for the most part, I like to use um, decoupled. <laughs> or if I'm gonna do like some, if I go like low atmospheric lights or like really low stuff, I like to go decoupled. But if I'm just like flying A to B, I'm not really trying to care too much, I'll just stay in coupled. Yeah, that's basically it. Like, I'll, I'll fly this like a fighter if I have to. It's got size four? I think, yeah, he's got two size the front, three guns. And then my mounts are size three. I can't remember what the guns are on that thing. I have fixed size fours in the front, two, and then I have uh, both my turrets are size threes, nice. and I have size two shields. So it's it's a tank. It's a beefy boy, you know that. Mm -hmm. People often underestimate it. Just because it takes forever to get through my shields. Unless they have something bigger. But a lot of fighters would be like, oh, we're gonna pick on this guy. I'm like, <laughs> especially if I'm full crude. Oof. Yeah, good luck getting through these fuck good, good luck getting through size three shields before they give you a chance to do anything. Alright, so let's go to I guess we could start at Babbage and then just find a path. That works. I can't select Babbage. Let's look it out of the way. There we go. I'll meet you there. You know, you can uh, do group jumps, right? Yeah, but uh, I don't ever. Like, I tried doing it the other day with a buddy, and every time we tried jumping, no matter what, one of us would jump, and the other person would, like, like we would jump, we wouldn't be together. Ever. We thought we had to have the same size quantum drive, the same quantum drive for it to work, so we didn't know. Because, like, I had a Voyage and he had an Atlas. I like the Atlas better, personally. That's just me. I like the voyage because it's technically just a little bit faster. Not a fuel lot. efficiency and the cooldown is what I'm going for because this ship is meant to run. I guess it's supposed to go fast. Fair enough. Like if I'm ever flying with the fleet, I'm not going to be on the front lines. <laughs> I'm going to be providing intel, most likely, with the, uh, with the hollow table eventually. So I'm going to want to be able to keep ahead of the enemy. Yeah. And quantum chasing, I'm sure, will be a thing. Oh yeah. It's going to eventually be a thing. I have a mantis as well. Snaring people. So fun. Jamming them as well. Yeah, I've been um, okay. Oh, hi. Yeah, I'm following you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's uh, let's start. I guess. Find us a spot. Start at the you top want. of this hill over here. We want a high point. That sounds good. I'll follow you down. Yeah. You think it's got some speed? It goes zoom. Yeah, it goes. <laughs> like a Tesla, just like you don't expect it to be so fast, but then you're just like, oh shit, it, it goes. Oh, the more I fly it, the more I love it. 
the more I spend like time in the back and just like observing, and, like, there's some fine detail. It's one of it's my one favorite few ships, ships that just had mid. like super, like, what they call like, super gold standard or whatever. Restricted area. Oh, leaving restricted area. Okay. <laughs> Almost just like what? It's like, fuck the rest of the restricted area. Is like I'm not really fun to. I'll be like, settle uh, here that's got turrets? Yeah, have some turrets firing at us as we're going through. That'd be fun. Ooh. Noxes do get targeted by the uh, people's turrets. I think it's weird how they treat hover flags like a uh, ship. <clears throat> oh, what a perfect landscape for our race to begin. Microtech is one of my favorite planets. Or, oh yeah, it really is. Have you done much like planet exploring in general? Um, I've done a little here and there. Like, I do a lot of solo play, so like, it kind of gets boring at sometimes. But like, I have done some by myself. I've gone on planets where like, I was in my uh, fucking year the other day, and I was on purposely like, going through and like doing cannon flying and like Magda and Daymar, but I was doing like really precision flying. Mm -hmm. And like getting like climbing the mountains, going in every nook and cranny, and looking for caves, stuff like that, and like landing, checking out the area and the scenery and stuff. Oh, that's what I love about this, and whether you're solo or not, uh, you can find wrecks that are not mapped. Yep, I found a couple wrecks, and I checked them out and stuff like that. And like it gets, it's making me excited for 318 because that's one of my favorite things to do. Is it's kind of like just edit them out. I'm like, oh, dude, what's this? Go check this out. I don't have like plans. Mm -hmm. I hate planning shit out. I like to just go with the flow and see what happens as I'm playing. Maybe that's why we're doing so well. Oh, this is a pretty ass view, dude. Right? That's what I was just observing <laughs> while you were talking. I was just like, yeah, he's right. Man, Look at this. This is just a gorgeous planet, dude. It's here, so I'm from here, Utah. Just take a peek. So like for me, and like we're in the middle of winter for us right now, and we have mountains that surround us all over the place. This map reminds me so much of like Colorado and Utah. I can see and that. Yeah. It I've makes me feel like home when I'm here. Like I just like I look at this. I'm like, man, I feel like I'm at my like mountain peaks of my own home. Like they did such a good just job because on I this. To take a view. We can land right here. I don't know if uh, <laughs> my stairs will come down right here. Let's uh, let's try that again. <laughs> See, I need to find more, just a little more. Flat. It's pretty flat over here. Here I can scoot over. So right there. Yeah. The Cuddy's ramp is notorious for being a pain in the ass. So are my stairs. You at least have two entryways. This one has one. Well, if I put my my cargo bay down right now, it would launch my ship because I'm on a bump. Well, another thing you can do technically is put your ramp down first and then come down gently as you land. And that way yeah, it'll leave it open for you. That's lame. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta come in smooth, you know, where you just zoom in, do a J turn or a J hook, then just plop down. Whip it down. Mm -hmm. Plop her down. But it's gonna be one of those plops where you just barely shake the suspension. Of Passing course, the storm starts up as we get out. Really? Oh. Yeah, I get out of my ship and there's a storm. The girl ship's uh, windshield is just, you know, this is what you'd like to see, right? Right. I must get to the top. I think 318 is going to be lit when there's like all these scattered ships just everywhere. People's dead bodies loot? And just dead bodies are going to randomly find cool loot, find cargo that you can just haul back to where back and forth. Can you imagine? Like there's going to be so many pirates that are still wanting to PvP and they're going to be too lazy to recover any of the cargo. Oh dude, they're going to be, gonna be like, oh they're like, dead, alright. Yeah, they're, they're going to be coming on the board. Loot, but that's it. They're gonna have like a, they'll have like their normal like pirating crew, but now they're also gonna have the addition of like, um, s 
salvage like vultures and then they'll have like one or two uh cargo ships to like pick the pick the cargo loaded up and go sell it and damn not, dude look at this okay so are you in third person uh let's see yeah and then hold f4 and use your mouse wheel down you can zoom, zoom out, out super yeah. far if you uh, zoom out so all the way beautiful. and then hit uh, hold F4 and then hit plus on your numpad, pad, and you can do it even more. Uh, damn, look at that. Yeah, dude. we're up here, dude. Oh, that, oh. <laughs> I can't even see the sun. I don't know if you're watching my stream, but this is... Just... Is something. This is crazy. I posted in Discord. That's what I see. Narabera, I presume that's you. Yeah, I just found your Twitch. Thank you. Appreciate that. Man, this game is amazing. It's fantastic. Like, damn. All right, let's go race. <laughs> Let's try to find an area that's not. No, no, this is a, this is our finish line right here. This, this, this be the finish peak line. that we're on right now, this view that we just saw, that is the finish line. This is what we're aiming for. Okay, I'm gonna shut the doors in on this. <clears throat> uh, I would actually just straight up power it down. It's powered down. Or do you want me to like kill the engines? Oh, okay, I no, no, no. Leave, you, I no, no, no. What you do I is uh, the keep the power on, signature. but max your shields. Yeah, shields are maxed, engines killed. Yep, okay. There you go. Oh. <laughs> it oh, kind no. of reminds me of a locust. Like, looking with my camera angle, like the super zoomed out camera angle, looking from the top, it looks like a locust. Or a grasshopper, whatever you call them wherever you are. <laughs> yeah, I have to do the hop thing to shut the Cuddy's door because it glitched out with the storm. No, your ship looks like a grasshopper or a locust. Oh, it does? Yeah, like if you zoom all the way out like we were doing on the canyon and look at your ship, like it, really look at your ship, the angles, the shape, the butt's a little bit fatter, it's got a bit of a belly just like a grasshopper or a locust. I see it. And the the engines would be the legs, like perked up and ready to jump. <laughs> That's totally a grasshopper. I am forever going to call that the grasshopper now. Oh no, I might this be uh, locked out of my cuddy. What? The ramp's broken. Can you get we want that like hop up? But like I don't oh, have any. We don't have. We have a lot of gravity oh, on this shit. planet. But with the <laughs> Noxes, we might be able to get it open. Wait, where's the button for this? Actually, hang on a second. I got an idea. Where's the button? Well, for the that? buttons are right here, but right now they're not working. Where? Like maybe they work here. Where? Oh, I think I got it. I just saw you punching it. Wait, it sounds like it's opening, but it's not opening. Yeah, I know, because I have to try to get this shut. I don't see the buttons. Oh, here we go. I see the now. Yeah, I can't interact with them. That's so weird. The other trick you're supposed to do is this. 
like jumping into this like spot right here. Well, another option is I could drop you on top of the ship and you could try to just strafe into the door as you, because it's open door as you uh, drop down. You want to try that? Oh, I got it. Watch your head. There we go. Okay. I shot it open. Alright, we're just going to leave that open. You sure we don't? Can you lock this door so people can't steal your ship? I don't here. think you can lock that one, no. Uh, see? The freelance? Or not the freelance. The 400i? You can lock them. Yeah. Like, it's honestly, it's like, it's not too flashy of a ship. It's just, it does what it needs to do. How do you wipe your... Uh, all X. No, I actually, I really like the cutties. They do it, they or, serve their the purpose. Cutlasses, the cutlasses, I mean. Well, they serve it well. They they serve multiple purposes very well. And the cool thing about it is, you learn one ship in their their family, and like you know the layout of all the ships. You know the whole, yeah. You it's know the entire this, ship. Yeah, it's just I could use this, and then I jump onto what is that new the the new gunship that they made? Oh, the Corsair. Yeah, I jump out of the Corsair, and the layout is so similar. You go from front to back, and then X, Y, Z are going to be in this order. Yep, and it's like almost the same as a cutter. Like it was, just, it's like a mini cutlass <laughs> when I get into exactly. it. Exactly. It's just like, like okay, boom. You learn one ship, and you learn them all. Exactly. So upgrading in the family is not ever an issue. I, don't know, I like I the design of the cutlass. I think they did a good job with the ship. This is what I would think of if I ever think of like, uh, like the Expanse. They do a really good job of mixing future technology with basic yep. rudimentary tools. It feels that like a futuristic helicopter, like the futuristic. Uh, uh, what is it? The like we have the current ones. They're in the the Navy just adapted them. The Marines in the Navy use them. I got out right as they were just bringing them in. Yeah, what and this called. could totally be a boat too. Yeah, it could also be a boat. If it had a hatch on the top, a narrow one on the top. Alright, let's go get board my ship. Let's they could make a variant of that, yeah. yeah. I'm already at your ship right now. Oh, I'm closing your ship. Oh, you can uh, leave the back hatch open. I think somebody in case in it glitches. I highly doubt anybody's going to fly by in a microtech right during this time. And we're not that far from a microtech. We're <laughs> literally on the, the mountain right next to it. I mean, if someone finds it, if anything, it's a treasure for them at this point. But we'll be able to see it fly off because it's yeah, a we'll we'll see the marker, and we'll be able to find your ship and just come back. Not only that, but one of my favorite favorite features. This is one of the fastest lifts in the game. Oh, dude, the lift is... I love it. <laughs> like, the MSR, I literally just jumped the thing because it's not even worth using yeah. the lift on that one. Right. And then, They're, like, every uh, other ship that has a lift, you're just like, okay, this takes a minute. Especially the Conny. Oh, my God. Yeah, and the uh, the Reclaimer as well. I don't know if oh, the Reclaimers, the yeah. The rec I've gone on the Reclaimer. That thing takes, like, 10 years. I think this has one of the best bridge views, too. View? No. I mean, like, or from viewability? A no. Aesthetics. Like, when you're, like, stand, yeah, from the yes. aesthetic, like, like it, it doesn't have the best tier. visibility, but, like, it just, it feels like a ship. Like, that, it's a ship. Yeah, yeah like that is, ship, Bill. This is what the elite fly. <laughs> Yeah, this like this feels like you're in a yacht. Like this feels like a mini yacht. And it's supposed to. It's like speed yes. yachts are a thing. Like they did a good job. Like this fits the concept of what it was supposed to be. Like other like the eight ninety, I honestly I don't know. I'm not a big fan of it. 
The 600i, I was confused about. Like, I know I hate it, but I'm confused by it. I, the smaller I hate it what origin because chips, I understand. of how poorly they executed it, and supposedly they're reworking it, and it's going to be fantastic. And yeah, I think they're reworking it. I will leave nice. that to judgment when it comes out. Yeah, I think they're reworking on it. looks nice. Honestly, I think the current 600i is the ugliest of the origin chips. Yeah, my favorite origin chip that I think has the most practical use that I like it for is the 85X. And then I honestly, my favorite bigger version is the 400i. <laughs> I love but, the 85X too. I only recently got it. Yeah, I got it early, early on. And it was like when they overpaid everybody. And it was on accident. The funny part was because I was still super, super new. And uh, I was at New Deal. And like the terminal was messed up and you could only keep grabbing the prospector so I was going to click over on the other one to see if you could buy something and I just accidentally hit confirm purchase I was like oh shit and I bought the 85x and then um, oh I thought that, that was smooth no that was us hitting it I bought it and then I ended up falling in love with it seeing how fun it was with a little ship it was a good little shuttle ship Dude, it's so stormy up here. Yeah, it's Microtech. Alright, there's our there's our starting point right there. Lake. Oh yeah, that's a good spot. Oh my god. <laughs> I hit that mountain. Did you actually hit it? Mm-hmm. That was us bouncing off of it. <laughs> that I thought was you were able to boost it. <laughs> we bounced. Hey, size free shield are doing lots of good now. Did not take any damage. Oh yeah, size three, not size two. Right? I think it's a size. We have single size three. Yeah, single size three. Yeah. Yeah, that's why I was like, yeah, they're taking shit. Not size two, size two is cool. Well, pretty easily. Because yeah, you have a full twenty-five bubble, right? Yep. That, that's a size three. Size two are the front and back 50, and then size ones are 25s, but obviously for small ships. Oh yeah, that's nice winning right there too. I like that J hook. I try. What the? F There's a log. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, that was ridiculous. Tiny last little log. Boom, right there. Yeah, just a random log out of nowhere. Uh, will you actually only open the car? Yeah, I'll go down and open the car. I'm going to divert to shields. Should bolt drop. Nice. Hold control. Wait until you you're on yours. Well, hold control when you turn it on to make sure you stay low. Or whatever your down is. Hold, hold it down. Yeah, I have Shake the... Uh... Oh, my stick. Well, that really the lowest I can go. There we go. Oh man, it's been. A hey, can we see the cutty from here? Here you should be able to see it on your radar. I don't see it. Well, it's on the other side of this mountain range. North, right? <laughs> I purposely uh, put it on the other side of the mountain range. You're right, I can't see us, right? So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to point the ship towards the cutter. That's a good idea. And that'll be our starting indicator. The fuck do I get in this thing? <laughs> Don't mind me owning this ship for who knows how long. That's okay. You get used to one way, you forget how the other way is working. 
I do actually like this better than most ramps, is because you can usually get in this ramp because as it has gravity the second you step on it. Yeah, it reminds me of the Banu's ramp. Oh, the merchant man? Yeah. Yeah. It's a shark knife. I don't know if anyone's ever shed with it or a whale knife. Merchantman and the Defender, they both have that nice little front ramp. The Defender's just tiny, obviously, but... I want the Defender. I it's, love the Defender. I want it just because it's a cool ship. I would be terrible at dogfighting. If it wasn't so expensive in game or in real money, I would have already oh, bought yeah. it. I would be my daily flyer. It's my favorite. I forgot this thing has Bulldogs. Um, where is your ship? See? I know it's over the mountain range, I just don't remember where. I'm trying to see if I can see it. Ooh, it hit a rock. Well, I guarantee I'll see it before you do. Probably. <laughs> Did I fly too far? You see it on your Moby Glass? Not yet, no. Oh my god, these storm clouds are almost touching the mountains. That's that's another thing I really enjoy is but yeah, the visibility the is rough with these storms. Yeah, but the volumetric clouding in general is just like I'm flying into a storm. This is going to be a storm. It's going to affect my flight. Alright, I honestly don't see it, and I'm way up here. We may have gone a little far. Yeah, I think so. That's okay. Oh, 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 oh. What was that? Turn back. Oh, rock. Should be able to see you then. It's your damn ship. It should give you an icon. It should say like X amount of meters away. Yeah, I know. It is over that mountain range, so whatever direction I'm facing right now. We need to go. I'm being targeted. That's me. Is that you? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I just like... to see where how far <laughs> I wanted to see like just uh, how far you were. It was hard to see the marker with the snow. So I'm currently pointing to fifty. Two fifty. And the direction we need to point. is to 90 degrees to my left. Approximately. Maybe 95. So approximately 105. That's our direction. 105? Yeah. Because I remember coming in on these two lakes, and they were side by side, and then I did 180. Towards east. Okay. Where are you? I'm right next to your uh, your bike. I don't see my bike. I can't target you either. You're to my right. <laughs> You're about 3,500 <laughs> meters to my shit. right. Where are you? You're to my yeah, right. To okay. <laughs> Where are you? I'm coming. No, are you on the? You're on the lake, right? I'm on the ground. No, you're on the lake. Like, yeah, I'm on the I'm lake. Going. I'm pretty sure. I can't tell you. I think you're going the wrong way right now. Really? Yeah, you're going away from me. 
Uh, where is my bike? Behind me. So I'm coming to you. Oh, you're way the fuck over there. Alright, now I need to reassess where I thought we were. Oof, tree. Alright, now you're coming towards me. to your Nox. Wait, we landed way over here? Yeah, your Nox is over here. Okay, I need to reassess <laughs> where we need to go. But I thought the two lakes over there were... What's that meant? Okay. Where the fuck are you? I can't target you. There you are. Okay. Ah, uh, her. Let me get my bearings really quick. Okay, so we need to go approximately... Seventy-five to eighty. Seventy-five to eighty. You got it. All right. Am I near my knocks? Uh, kind of. You're like three hundred feet away. Three hundred fifty. Which direction? Based on what I'm. Fly face. backward. G ship. I'd like it if you turned on. Hey, okay. Okay, okay. It's not too high, so that we don't overshoot it too far. Right, slow down. And go straight down. Just a little bit back, a little bit back. Right there, perfect. Perfect. 69. That's what I'm talking about. You're exactly 69 meters. <laughs> nice. I don't know wonder I couldn't fly properly. I want the powers to my shields. That's also why I probably couldn't scan your ship. Pretty little power. It said 70 to 75, right? 75 to 80. 75 to 80. That direction. We should see it if we go that direction. Okay, so I'm facing exactly halfway between 75 and 80 right now. Same direction as my ship? Looks like it. And I'm right in front of your Nox. Are you taking a bomb? That sounds like a bomb. Heart rip, but yeah. Heart rip? The what do you call them, like the carts? I don't know what you're talking about. Little cartridges ones, like the. <gasps> All right, so here's what we're doing. We're just starting on each side of this leg. Okay, I'm going like the other face side. Ends. I gotta pee before we start, and then I'm ready to go. I, do you want to take like a quick two minute break, grab some water, pee, do whatever you want to do before we start this race? Because this if we die, it's over, and I'm gonna try my hardest not to die. Well, Even if I have to go slow. But pray these noxes don't blow up on us. Well, that's the point. Is we the objective is to finish the race. Being first is great, but I want to see if we can finish this race as fast as we can, but as safe as we can, because these do blow up really easily. Oh, I know. Like really easily. Yeah, yeah. There we go. I'm gonna come a little closer. That's a cool screenshot. Tell me the degree you're facing so we can face the exact same way. I'm gonna do. I'm in third person. Hang on. Let's see. I'm in. 80 exactly. I'm facing 80. Exactly. I am. What do you call it? Halfway between 80 and 75. So you want me to face 80 on the dot? 
I wish it wasn't stormy because I'm watching the sh like two noxes and the, the 400i right there. I want to take oh, a quick screenshot of this. Shit. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing Let's right there. I got my screenshot. Zoom in. Oh, the storm's gone. It's meant to be. Whoops. And you know that you can like change the position of your camera, right? Yeah. Your arrow keys. Yeah, and you can also change the uh, heights with page up and page down mm -hmm. while holding mm -hmm. F4. I'm missing the gun on mine. We're shooting the shields of my ship. We should stop. <laughs> Gonna get a crime stat. We're in the bubble. I'm just trying to get screenshots. I was just trying to get a cool screenshot. That's even cooler. Okay, new screenshots. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Yeah, it looks amazing. Have a fleet of these with escorting a 400 i at low atmosphere. That would be dope. Oh, no, my camera's stuck. everything now that the storm is gone all right so be careful for little rocks by the way they will oh yeah right, they will flip you i'm sorry I've, I've like had to pee for it too oh you're good no worries i'm trying so hard how are you so damn close i'm trying to match you You're pretty close. Yeah, we're at the same where I'm at. Right about there. And then just angle yourself to the right a little bit. Oh, too low. Oh, that looks sweet. Now we both have the frost cover. There. I've been posting on my screenshots on Discord. Super close. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. I'm sorry. I've been. Oh, you're good. No worries.
wanna communicate Can't smile it and all, all this time is passing by But I still can't seem to tell you why It hurts me every time I see you Realize how much I need you I hate you, I love you, I hate that I love you Don't want to but I can't but nobody else about you I hate you, I love you, I hate that I want you You want her, you need her, and I will never be her From every don't remember Do you miss me like I miss you? Messed around and got attached to you Friends can break your heart too And I've always tired the matter of you If I could wear you on you You wouldn't like that shit I put this real off But you wouldn't like that shit I type a text but then I never mind that shit I got this feeling But you never mind that shit Oh, oh, we'll keep it on the low You're still in love with me But your friends don't know If you wanted me You would just say so And if I were you I would never let me go I hate you I love you I hate that I love you Don't want you But I can't Nobody else about you I hate you, I love you I hate that I want you You want her, you need her And I will never be her Show you how to do it and we start real slow You just put your lips together and come real close Can you blow my whistle, baby, whistle, baby Here we go Alright, objective one, have fun Objective I recommend two, we do this really quick before we do this. Objective three, <laughs> win. But go on. Uh, let's hurry and ride inside your ship really fast. Defrost, because you're having, I don't know if you've noticed, you have probably have a uh, defrost animation around your uh, visor. Yeah, I didn't. I'm in third person, so I don't know. I'm good. Oh, I just no. need to hurry and run. <laughs> just like it. But I'm hurrying this thought really quick for a couple seconds. Yeah. And then we'll do this. I, I was doing the same thing. I was in third person and I got out and I was like, oh, I can't see very good. <laughs> uh, hydrate too. Do you need water? So, no, I'm good. I 100 percented. like a different little uh, wheel that pops up and then you go into uh, it? actions player emo and then you go from there I don't have a dance I have a green and then you go through there and then uh, you'll see the little thing in the middle oh, there's like yeah. options yeah. and then yeah. it'll be alphabetical all right and those are all the different emo options you can do 
Didn't do it. Sometimes they're buggy. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. open I've been to the bathroom I like it let's do this <clears throat> we've got 50 minutes until we die plenty of time that's assuming we make it that far <laughs> exactly remember first rule be careful second have fun or no first rule have fun second rule be careful third rule win I like it. All right, seventy-five to eighty, right? Yep. All right. I'd say eighty to be safe. I see my line. You're going eighty. Yep. Okay. Then I'm also gonna go eighty. Are you ready? Yes, sir. We're gonna go on go. I'm gonna count from three. Okay. Ready? Oh, another rule of thumb. Stay low unless you have to go high to survive a jump. Sounds good. Or something. All right. Ready? Yes, sir. Three, two, one, go. Here we go. <laughs> I'm oh, already hit a tree. Now. I'm using my sticks only. Oh, no. Oh, my God. It's so hard. We gotta survive. That's I know, actually, I hit a tree. I didn't even see it was a tree, and I hit a tree. Breaking is not. Uh, breaking is something you should embrace. I'm That's not. what I should say. So, I'm using my sticks to be fair to you, since you said you're using yours. I'm also using sticks. Oh, it's a rock that was blended in with the melon. We're safe. We made it. It does decouple. It does decouple, wow. I mean, you can go around if you need to. Yeah, I'm trying to figure. I'm like looking. It's like I can probably climb this, but like I don't want to risk it. Oh, my weapons just got destroyed. Yeah, I have, I'm down to one gun. All right, can I see? I see you. Mm -hmm. You're way further I'm going ahead. Good. I'm making some good time. You're killing it. Oh no, I'm gonna hit a tree. I hit a tree. Shit. I got stuck. I'm stuck in trees. Oh, I'm totally gonna cheat. There we go. Going the wrong direction. Gravity wins. Going the wrong direction. Okay, that's five. Go that way. Oh no, that's a tree. Oof. 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 I see you here right in front of me. Yeah, buddy. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> it's so hard, dude. It's like bowling in the uphill. I'm, I'm going like 20 miles an hour. I'm hauling it up this mountain top. The problem is, is I haven't gotten out of these trees yet. Oh, man. Where's my ship? Where is it? There we go. Here we go. Straight away. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh! Oh no! Where am I going? I totally somehow missed all those trees. And then I hit the tiniest little stump at the very end. Oh, I'm gonna hit a wall! How did I? Oh, I hit a tree. I'm alive. I hope this is the right way. For so far. Ooh. 
Slow down, slow down, See you behind me. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, I'm alive. I'm alive. Oh, 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 oh. Do that, do that, do that. <laughs> we're going, we're going, we're making time. <laughs> Oh my god. I look like I'm going the right way. Wait, I just saw. Is that you that I just saw? I'm going 85. That's you. Okay, that was me who pinged you. <gasps> oh no. That's a rock. Oh. I, I don't know if I'm going the right way. Let's go 85 or 80, 85, remember? I know, I'm trying to figure out where I'm at right now. <laughs> I, I'm literally right next to you all of a sudden. Wait, what? Oh! Oh, we yeah, almost ran into you. It's a good thing I stopped. Okay, hang on. This way. If you're lucky I just deleted Star Citizen, okay. otherwise you'd be dead by now. I would have a new ship. <laughs> so we're gonna go up and over this. Okay, here we go. Here we go. This is a terrible canyon. Yeah, this is hard. Oh! I'm not going up there, I'm going around it, bro. Oh, shriek. I'm alive. Nice. Shouldn't be, but it's I like am. the Iditarod. Spaceship Iditarod. Let's see. Yeah. I think I lost an engine, because I'm like, I'm struggling hard. Way I don't need to go. This way. Have you seen the ship yet? Nope. <laughs> I'm hoping that we're going the right way. Do you see my ship? Not anymore. Now I have to see your marker for you. Come on, baby, climb this mountain. Oh, I made it up the mountain. Come on. That's what we've been training for. <laughs> Oh, oh, oh this is amazing. I just jumped over it like a m massive cliff. I'm gonna save myself from crashing into rocks. What am I floating on? A tree. See you way over there. Yes. Do you see the ship yet? No. <laughs> I don't even see my ship. I'm like in a goalie. You see my marker, yeah? Yeah, I see you. Oh, I just hit a tree. Look, trying to look at you. Say it's four zero, bro. Oh yeah, the chest. Hopefully oh. my ship didn't get despawned, or somebody come by and steal it, or blow it up, or blow it up. Ooh, I'm starting to see something that looks maybe familiar. Oh, oh. Flying mm. high. <laughs> so much fun to take these things out on low gravity oh, planets, shit. dude. Oh, yeah. Alright, where am I? I can't wait for the Ranger to be out. Little motorcycles. Oh, I've been waiting for that. For oh, I'm ever. so excited for those. Those are gonna be so much fun. How did I just avoid every one of those trees? I'm not sure if we're going the right way, my dude. 
Like, I'm just around a bunch of trees right now. Did we really go this far? Maybe. Somehow I am Do a god at dodging all because these trees. It was right next to the new Babbage. I'm a god at dodging trees somehow. I see. I think so we need to Babbage? turn right a little bit more. Our arrows are pointed to the left. Oh god, another tree. So I'm gonna go. Can I? 175. Can you set a marker from here? I actually want to try this. Not with these, they don't have quantum. But since it's on a technically a vehicle, can you set. No, you can't. Okay. But we are close. Yeah, I'm Where going 175 at? approximately. So you're going which way? Which way? 175. 175. About 350. Never. You're facing a different direction than me, though, aren't you? Well, I just crashed into the tree, so I'm facing the wrong direction. Oh god, my ship is not looking great. Yeah, mine's not even steering properly. <laughs> Trying to see if I can see the lake from here. Like in the third person. Maybe in front of me? Well, I can find out. How does this thing fly deep before you this? Not good at all. No, I, I turned it on and immediately turned it back off. Or turned it off and turned it back on. Back over to this clearing because this may or may not be the ice lake. Wish we had someone who was like in a, our party who was in New Babbage. Like, yeah, your ship's right here. They could just be like, yo, like I'm in New Babbage. So, like, I could use them as like our marker to like go to. <gasps> Ooh. That would be <laughs> well, that really helpful. Me. Well, I'm going for the highest peak because that's what we parked on, right? think so? I'm I don't remember. Sure you know, going... We parked up high on a mountain and I don't see any mountains up. Actually, I lie. I see a mountain 170 over there. is where I'm going. You're going 170? The moment I'm headed toward... You're so far away. <laughs> heading like northeast at the moment. I don't even think I'm anywhere near. No, this is this is Planet Hoth. We're stuck out in the winter. These are our tauntauns, and they're slowly dying. Yeah, mine's taking a fucking beating. I can't even see my my HUD right now. It's so white. Mine's nice and clear still, luckily. I well, I made it up, but my ship is flying like it's got some problems. Yeah, mine too. Oh wow, you're 20 clicks away from me. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm trying to come to you. I'm trying to think what other mountain tops would be a good option to go to. <laughs> well, the problem is, is I've lost the market of my ship. We're supposed to be able to see it from ultimate distance, like global distance. The post to is a strong word in this game. 
Mm -hmm. Oh wow, you're. So I'm gonna come to you. I'm, I'm definitely not in the right place. My engine is backfiring like every two seconds. I might have to make a rescue beacon, bro. Oh no. I got an idea if we make it out of this. <laughs> we'll go to New Babbage and we'll do a race there. <laughs> yeah, and then we'll do it uh we'll start from like the garage over at like uh one of the things that we'll decide to go through like the tracks or something like that we'll have to go from like one side from like the commons do a whole like a lap two or three laps there and back or something shit like that yeah we had a couple more people we could make this work i think we just parked it for a while yeah it might be but I'm wondering if they, I think my 10K ship, I, is maybe the max. I have a feeling my ship got destroyed or it despawned. It didn't despawn for any reason unless you spawned something else. It could be just because we have the uh, the Aopas going, the Noxes. I, it, just, it recycles stuff after three. After you claim, like you claim three ships, it'll. It'll recycle the first, but you haven't claimed three. But I'm wondering if it's just being goofy because we're in your 400 eye. I've had max ships out for multiple hours. I, know, I always have bad luck with this, this game when it tries to come to multi-vehicle multi things. Really? Oh yeah. Or cheaper. Chris Roberts, I feel like, has a personal well, bad Well, maybe I'm see. just used to the issues that they're not really big issues for me. And it's so hard to see right now. I luckily have nice visibility. This is actually a lot of fun. This is one of the most, some of the most fun I've had in the game in a minute. Just, like, cruising. Like, I'm hauling ass through these trees right now, just, like, zooming. I've I'm actually gotten the hang of this pretty good. Trying. You gotta do a little more like left Ooh, and right straight. That was a cliff. <laughs> oh shit. I'm about 2.5 to you. I'm almost there. Yeah, I've been coming to you the whole time too. See me flying. Ooh, it's a tree. Oh, I've got 21 seconds left of survival. 21 minutes. seconds? I've got a minute left of survival. Oh no. That's why you're dying too cold. I don't have armor on. <laughs> Shit. Also, I broke my leg. Oh no, that would, that's not good. Oh. oh. <laughs> At least I got off my vehicle. <laughs> An extra pair of uh, armor or heavier armor? Light armor On me? No. Armor? <laughs> Did that get you all? I died immediately again. Oh, oh I'm back up. There we go. I'm shivering so much. Oh, my character is shivering really bad too. I don't have a med gun. I do, hang on. So screwed. Never, never say never. <laughs> you want me to put out a beacon? You should, yeah. See if anybody will come pick us up. I should totally be able to heal you more. Why can't I? Try heal to you keep more? me alive as best you can. I can't even <laughs> view it. It's it's so shaky. My dude is shivering so hard. <laughs> Damn, I'm dying rapidly now, too. Like the cold. 
like my, I put my a guy's beacon temperature out? can't keep up with it. Wait, did it did it work? I'm not sure. I didn't see anything about a beacon. Oh god, my gun's empty. There we go. There it, it is. Oh, well, I'm down. <laughs> Oh, where's my body going? I got you, don't worry. I'll make sure it doesn't go too far. <laughs> You're gonna keep dying every couple seconds because of the cold. So I'm gonna keep you tucked Well, I have an hour here. and a half when I'm down. Yeah, I know. So I'm just gonna keep you over here. <laughs> but like if I revive you, you're gonna drop again, so I don't wanna waste Keep the, me in the sunlight. Like <laughs> Build a fire. Why? Why? I'm gonna put you on my bike. We're gonna we're gonna ride into the sunset. <laughs> that would be really cool if you could. That would be so cool. To you. <laughs> just like, all right, bro. Where's my wrap? Put some bungee like wrap on. Movies, right? They just. You know, hang them over in front of them and be like, let's go. Just mount you on my thing like a prize. <clears throat> and today we caught ourselves a wild rayu. Enough the rarest breeds. Oh my god, that worked. Wow. I'm gonna fall off immediately, but... <laughs> yep. <laughs> Got my head's in the ground. Oh god, my camera's... I could, like, flip you. Like the gun. <laughs> the camera's freaking out so much. Oh god, I'm gonna die myself with the gun. There cold. we go. Well, it was a good run. Oh my god, the visibility is so bad. I can't check to see if somebody accepted my beacon. Can you see if there's a beacon? <laughs> Two wild souls. <laughs> Your beacon up still? It should be. Oh god, my character's so cold and shaking too. <laughs> I know, right? Oh my god. Let's see, service beacons. No, your beacon's not theirs. So I don't know if somebody accepted it. Oh, I'm putting out another. I'm holding it. There we go. See, who's the uh <laughs> Kozak? Kozak? Want me to add him? Which one's the party leader? Me or you? Me. You? Which means you know. can't get I'm pretty sure here. I can't change it. Yeah, you're the party leader. Stay, wanna stay. 
Like the storm is so bad, I go to look up by the trees where the sun is, dude, and you can't see. Yeah, I have third person. So. Like this is what heaven is probably what people <laughs> imagine. It's like I could see the light at the, the end light. of the tunnel. The light. Yep, in the white. The white light. And here I lay, ready to enter. Yeah, the here you are. Hang on. Oh my god, this is it. This is the moment. <laughs> You're gonna bring me up Take to him. the light. Take I him. see the light. Wait, wait, wait. Keep it there. Keep it there. I'm gonna screenshot <laughs> Come this. Back. Come I'm back. gonna screenshot this. Oh my god, okay. Wait, wait, wait. I wish I could see this from <laughs> no. my perspective. Okay. Oh shit, my camera's really close to me. <laughs> wait, okay. <I> fell. <laughs> oh my god, my computer's freaking out. It's like a slideshow of my. Oh, this is too good. Bye, buddy. <laughs> You're gone from my screen. I'm coming down. Oh, no. I, oh, there you are. Okay, I got you. <laughs> Come back. It was a slideshow the entire time for me. My frames were hating me. So it was... I was just flailing around in slideshow. Man. If your stream records, I'm gonna watch this at the end of the night so I can see what that was from my perspective. I wanted to see your angle of that. That was so funny. I've got seven Approximately minutes. Approximately four hours and 45 to 50 minutes into the stream. Sounds Write good. that down. Maybe a little earlier. I mean, I'm dead, so it's a good fun place to find me. <laughs> I can't get my camera to get a good top angle. There we go. What? Are, why are my legs up? Your legs? I don't know. It's kind of uncomfortable. <laughs> I don't like it. Wait, wait. Why are you sliding? Oh. There we go. What's up, Rusty Ghost? How's it going? You have a tier three, yeah. Injury? Yeah. Broken leg and hypothermia. Am I new by any chance? No, not at all. I'm. This is what a seasoned vet's life is like. They go boldly into the unknown with no equipment. Yep, this is exactly ready to what face we the do. Cold. <laughs> Come on, why can't I lay down? We, we know the risks. We know the. Life. We know what we were signing up for. <laughs> exactly. Well, let me. I've been playing prone. for there about nine years. Yeah, you've been enough. playing for a hot minute. Not like nine years straight, but like I'd play several times throughout each year. There you go. Look, now I'm dead next to you. No, you're not. I or at least I'll head. soon be dead. You're just sitting there. <laughs> there you go. Spin the bottle. Beyblade burst. Yeah, I'm gonna die any minute now. My screen's all sorts of fuzzy. I can barely see my screen to make this beacon. This is insane. <laughs> oh god, the noises my character is making right now. <laughs> it's like agony. Barbarossa. Uh, Barbarossa's on her way. Yeah, I just put out another one just way. in case they need. And then people are gonna show up and they're gonna be like, "Ah, oh, well, who gets paid?" I don't care. I'll pay him. <laughs> I don't really give a shit about money right now. Oh God, I've, my I my vision's all white, bro. I think this is it. See, wait, wait, face the light. Face the light. Facing it. Oh. There you go. Wait, I must face you towards the light. 
my camera angle is quite. Did I just permanently die? You shouldn't have. I did. Oh no, you did. Oh, your butt is gone. <laughs> oh no. The cold killed me. Faster. I just got stormy and I died. I'm just gonna walk into the water. Will you let them know that I'm dead because I've got a black screen? Yeah. Wait, you committed homicide against me. Wait, what? <laughs> How? <laughs> Did you do the uh, the backstab oh. on me trying to pick me up? <laughs> Dude, I'm literally gonna live. I am literally gonna live with like a minute left. <laughs> I don't know how the hell I killed you. That was so good. <laughs> oh. I believe I forgave you. I hope I forgave you. I press the decline bracket. Wait, you got saved? Yeah, this dude landed the last second. Can you see your ships? Now that you're aboard a ship? I got, I like, he, it was the scariest landing of my life too. He like, <laughs> like, <laughs> right up below my head, dude. Just What is he flying? Like, putty red. Nice. He has me laying in the med bed right now. Okay. Treatment. If only oh, yeah. you hadn't backstabbed me. I didn't backstab you, bro. I swear. <laughs> you backstabbed. Me. I don't know how I could have backstabbed you. I hit drag body, and all of a sudden you're just you're dead. <laughs> all right, so I'm gonna take another ship so I can go recover my my uh 400. I'll take the Pisces. You're gonna regret do what again? Sorry. I'm taking my Pisces so I can go recover my four, uh, 400 eye. And then go recover the Nexus. I hope I'm close to you. I actually don't know where I am. I think I'm at Tressler. I like how nobody commented on you just backstabbing me. <laughs> he glitched out and died. I stabbed him and left him for dead. I did not leave you for dead. Stop it. <laughs> it hurt my Stabbed soul, in bro. the back. <laughs> no, you good. I mean, I could totally do that to this guy if I wanted to right now, but I'm not the <laughs> player. Yeah. I know that you were trying to carry me. <laughs> it's just funny that you... I accidentally was holding my knife in my hand while I tried to pick you up. Right. Oh no, is my game. I might have just glitched out. Oh no. No, it was like server crash. Or like, game crash. The game just grows. Oh, no. Remember what mining facility we went to? I think it was Shubin 22. Or the second one? I don't know. We went for New Babbage. Oh shit, I need probably to do it. Oh, I see you. Yeah, my game just grows.
I see my dead body actually. stuff there go ahead and take it i thought you died or uh, i thought you got it i don't know i might be dead i don't know i just like my my game's frozen so you just warped away so your entity is still on the ship at least Oh no, it's not here. It ended that gun. Here's the Nox.
What? Where did it go? Hmm. I think it disappeared. <laughs> it's over there. Notice me, Senpai? Notice me, Senpai?
What's up, Cliff? How's it going? <laughs> All right, <laughs> that was to be expected. for low flowing. What are you up to there, please? You're up to sleep. It's fair. Welcome it's pretty late your time. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Please visit us again. <laughs> Enjoy the spaceships. Alrighty, man. Have a good night. Sleep well.
insurance claim has been sent. Your insurance claim has been sent. Your insurance claim has been sent. Yo, do you want to fly with me? Mr. Dude at Port Tressler right here in front of me. You want to fly?
Welcome to the ASOP Vehicle Retrieval System. Vehicle selected. Stand by. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Please visit us again. Thank you, and please visit again.
Point. Great game. I think that's a cue for me to call it. Thanks for hanging, everybody. Have a good night.